a game that speaks for itself in so many ways. Two terrific teams prepared to give it everything in their quest for glory. It's the kind of match you cannot afford to take your eyes off, even for a minute. Well, hello to you and welcome to another exciting game brought to you by EA TV. Guy Mowbray here for commentary with Sue Smith alongside me. And we've got a game for you today from Serie A. Sue, what can we expect from the game then? Yeah, cheers, Guy. It's great to be here. I think it's important that both teams are focused from the off, though, and they start quickly. But I'd love to see some goals. Hopefully I've not just cursed it. Here's how the home side lines up. It certainly looks like a 5-3-2 out of possession, but a 3-5-2 when they're in possession. They will look to stay compact when they don't have the ball, and the distance between the units, I'm sure, will be small. Need to be clinical, though, when they do go forward. Oh, that's been won really smartly. Cristante. Dybala. Dybala! And it's all been sorted out by the goalkeeper. We all know how difficult it can be to contain Romelu Lukaku when he's fit and firing. What should we expect today, Sue? Well, I love the way he plays. He makes the game look easy. His first touch, his dribbling ability, the way he sees a pass, and then he executes it. He's got to be one of the best in his position. Really nicely played. What can they do with this now? Dybala. Right idea. Wrong execution, I'm afraid. Politano. The hard work pays off. They won the ball. This is a positive-looking move. Well, it looked promising, but only up to a point. Ossiman, he's hit that well, but it's travelled straight into the goalkeeper's gloves. Read the pass well and cuts it out. Matteo Politano. Dybala. Lovely ball. This could lead to something. It's got to be special from there. No problem at all in keeping that one out. Cristante. Christensen. Lukaku. Ryan Cristante. Dybala nicely sets it up. Chance to go ahead. It's in. 1-0. And that could change the shape of the game. And we could watch that sort of skill all day. But that's where it ends with the ball one this time. Christensen. And the pass has been misplaced. Angisa getting into a good position. That has gone like a rocket. It's an absolutely wonderful goal. for the finish Dybala and they want to see a shot here excellent reading of the game to win the ball good work to recover possession Politano. And the attack is over. Really good defending. Found nicely and in. They've scored. 
and that gives them a priceless lead. Paolo Dybala. That's a lovely ball. There might be something building now. And the ball has been lost. Matteo Politano. Brian Cristante. Romelu Lukaku. Moving forward well. The ball is lost and the chance has gone too. Ossiman, and away it goes. Nothing doing from that one. Well read to gain possession. He takes it on. Oh, it was a pretty good effort. Oh, I thought that was going to be the equaliser there. It wasn't far away. Not a bad attempt, that guy. Romelu Lukaku. Dybala, and the keeper's done really well to keep that out. Already leading by one, and they press home their advantage from this corner. Played towards the edge of the penalty area. And he's done really well to keep that out. And that'll do it. Off we go, the second half underway. Matteo Politano and the wrong side of the defence offside ball taken away from them Ossiman that's a good ball no need to worry about that effort for the keeper good pressure this high up the pitch Ryan Cristante. You can only say positive things about the display of Romelu Lukaku up to this point. He's putting his stamp on the game. Oh, terrific from the keeper. Super speed, razor sharp reactions. Politano. Stanislav Lobotka. And the hard work pays off. They won the ball. A chance for the breakaway here. Dybala. Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. Victor Osimen. Barat Kelia. Moving it forward with purpose. Something on, maybe. Lukaku. Another goal. And it's one that tightens their grip on this game. Politano. Now Ozzyman. Working hard to win it back there. That will be a free kick. And what a place for it to be awarded. And it's a good strike, not far away. Oh, it is. It's a decent effort, that. It's a good technique. Manages to get it over the wall, but just doesn't get it back down in time. Spinazzola. And this could be. Oh, what a tackle to break up the play. Dybala. The approach play looked encouraging, but good defending to snuff out any threat. Kovicha Kavaratskalia. Now it's Zielinski. Well, can he get onto this? It's 
gone out and it's a corner and they go short with the corner goes for goal and that is one heck of a hit it's flown past the keeper it's a challenge that's brought a whistle and a free kick oh that's been won really smartly Paolo Dybala Dante, can he finish? It's cleared, and they can breathe easier. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Anguissa. A move of real promise developing. Has to be. Off the defender, corner kick. A short corner taken. Dybala. There's a chance for them to go now. The crowd urging him to shoot. And it's on now. It just needed the finishing touch. A nice move ends there. Dybala. Oh, they've lost it. The attack is over. It looks the right ball. Having a look. This is a promising looking attack. Well, it looked promising, but only up to a point. Ossiman. This is a positive move as they seek that equaliser. And the keeper makes the save. Really, we shouldn't have expected anything else. Well, with time running out, can they take advantage from this corner? Spinazzola. Could turn out to be a really good ball. Spinazzola. Great chance here. And there's the hat-trick. He'll be taking the match ball home. Lukaku. They're not getting close enough here. Politano. And it's a pretty good save by the keeper. Possession changes hands and far too cheaply. Lovely ball, now what can they do with it? And the keeper has it to avert the danger. Paolo Dybala. Spinazzola. Struggling to keep the ball there. Politano. Di Lorenzo. There is the final whistle. Plenty of positive forms. It was a positive performance. Some of the play today was great to watch. They moved the ball quick and created some really good openings. It's a good result.
Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring... Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly. Hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. And the starting lineup for Juventus. Wojciech Szczesny stands between the posts. Weston McKenney starts alongside Adria Rabio in the centre of the park. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Brian Cristante starts alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield. And up front, Paolo Di Bala starts alongside Romelu Lukaku. of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward that's what they're doing foiling his opponent completely corner kick played in clearance left a bit to be desired and there the move ends for now Lukaku well this could rip can they forge ahead and that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him Dybala good effort here and keeping it out oh that's top notch goalkeeping you've got to say Weston McKenney. The ball with Chiesa. Juventus keep possession and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Well, he knows it. The shot needed to be just a bit lower. Lukaku. Dybala. Confident play from Dybala. And still looking to get the shot off. And there is the goal that gives them a well-merited lead. It had been coming. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Federico Chiesa. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Nice switch of play. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? Firing it towards goal and effectively parried away by the keeper. Juve looking for a bit of magic. Will it come from this corner? And he clears the danger. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? And hit with ferocity. It was close, but not quite good enough. Lukaku. Paredes. Here's Cristante. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Zibala. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. 
Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Vlahovic. Very effective passing sequence. Wonderful chance. Well, he opted for power from close range. He might be regretting that now. Lukaku. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Weston McKenney. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Dybala. Here's Cristante. And Juve come away with it. Well, we're almost at the halfway stage and they're not making home advantage work for them one little bit here. Stuart, your assessment? Well, they can certainly play better than this. It's been a disappointing first half display from them. But if they can just play with more urgency and energy in the second half, they can get back into this. They definitely have the quality. And defensive play to be applauded. And there goes the half time. The start of the second half here in Turin tonight. Vlaovic. Has a go. And pushed away to safety. Brian Tristante. Romelu Lukaku now. Can they take advantage? Well, not allowed to continue. He had drifted into the offside position. Well, if he takes a step back to the ball and then spins in behind, he'll be onside. But he does know where the space is. Ibala, that was untidy. Lukaku. The ball with Chiesa. Rabio. That's a good looking ball. It should be. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, these fans can sense an opportunity here. They need to make the most of this corner. Still not clear. And I think the threat has been averted. And fed forwards. Well, it looked like a decent avenue of attack, but he couldn't keep himself onside. Well, he's just a bit too eager there. All well and good playing on the shoulder, but he just needs to bend his run to stay onside. He's played it out over the touchline, so a throw-in to restart things. Locatelli. Timely intervention. Well, he was dreaming of scoring, but ruled offside. Well, it all happened very quickly, so I wouldn't criticise him too much. At least he was in there. And possession lost by Juventus. Lukaku. So, a half an hour remaining. Dybala. A good vision there. It comes to absolutely nothing. Paredes. Nicely timed tackle. Dybala. Rabio, and it's with McKenney. Good distribution in position. 
and you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Well, body in the way. Bremer. Very good interception. Good weight on that pass. Just have to look a bit lively given the pressure. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Great vision to switch the play. Chiesa. McKenney. And putting his body on the line. And diving to thwart him. Paredes Spinazzola and back with Dybala it's with Paredes that's a good looking ball and there is the goal he's found in it joy unconfined Chiesa, safe pair of hands, did his job. Dybala. Giving the ball away. Brian Cristante. It's with Dybala. Dybala. A glorious chance. Well, far too much elevation there. Federico Gatti. Rabio. Vlaovic. McKenney. Happy to take on the shot. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Brian Tristante. It's with Paredes. Well, they couldn't keep possession. to win it back Kostic Locatelli with it oh it might be in it goes it looked as though they were down and out not a bit of it what will happen next and the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute and there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for. The stats will tell you, they had more possession, they created better chances, and they were the more dominant side. But that counts for nothing. They've lost a the game they should have won.
The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides. A huge night at a great stadium. We're here at the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position. And alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly. Hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward. Is it going to be? Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. Lukaku. A real struggle to contain him. And this is how it looks for Inter. Jan Zommer is the goalkeeper. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays. Will he finish? Oh, blocked it! Inter have given away possession. Lukaku. And the referee sensibly allowing them to carry on. Advantage with them. Mkhitaryan Marcus Tuham Can he finish? With no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper Christensen Paredes It's with Dybala Well nicely cut out Now what can they do with the ball? It's a good inter move in the making. A fine reading of the situation. Mancini. It's with Dybala. Paredes. Ndika. And giving it away. a really good pass Christensen a possession lost intercepted and Inter might be able to cash in here Paredes perfect tackle Mkhitaryan now with Turam oh it's narrowly wide so unlucky and giving the ball to the opposition that time Varela Happy to take on the shot. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. In the short corner, let's see. Barella. Decides to shoot. And a fantastic diving save. Corner kick played in. The crossbar got in the way. But it just petered out. Well, Inter could easily be leading now. They certainly look threatening every time they go forward. You just sense a goal is coming here. Perfect challenge. Turam. Martinez. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. Well, as you can see, Inter have been in complete control in the last 15 minutes and they're playing really well and creating chances. It should... It's got to be! A pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Well, really rifling that one in and he didn't miss by much. Paredes...
Well, that's the sign of a well-organised defence. Tuham. Varela has it. Dybala. Back to Dybala. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Turam. Not the best challenge, free kick. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Paredes. Romelu Lukaku now. Nice looking pass. And defensive play to be applauded. Turam. Teammates available. Outrageously skillful. Textbook defending inside the box. A long way out. Oh, at one point on its flight, it looked as though it might be going in. Well, he wasn't afraid to have a go, was he? And you can see why. That was so close to being a great goal. there for him and it goes the opening goal in this contest <laughs> well, it's advantage inter after the first 45 minutes but a long way from the issue being settled here as ice for goal Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Oh, what's he gone and done? Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. Now, on the back of that breathtaking piece of goalkeeping, can they keep the ball and create? And making the run to the inside. Oh, that surely had to go in. But marvellous defending. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. Oh, a really good header, but the goalkeeper there's a cover-up. Well, a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Very quick thinking there. Tenacious tackling, excellent defending there. Well, he played his part in the first half, that's for certain. Marcus Turam, sum up his contribution for us. Well, Derek, after a slow start where he was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first half went on, and he got his reward with that goal. I'm looking forward to his second half display. That's a lovely ball. Not showing good defensive judgment. He'll have a go here. Well, an attempt almost from a different postcode and not very far away. Well, from that sort of range, that's a very decent effort. Brian Tristante is with Paredes. Nicely <laughs> timed tackle. Alessandro Bastoni. Turan. On to Mkhitaryan. High pressing and good high pressing. And he takes it on! Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Really good challenge. Now well, attacking possibilities for the Nerazzurri. That is not going to do. Well wide of the target. Into regaining possession. Martinez. 
Now with Vicky Tarian. Could be. There's still danger here. Well, nothing untoward happened. Brian Tristante. And playing it through. Intercepting it intelligently. Into the final 20 minutes. Can they hit on the break? Well, it looks so promising, but it all comes to nothing. Barella. Turam. Now with Martinez. Barella has it. Return to Martinez. Vital intervention. Well, a corner and maybe an opportunity for Inter to make it look even better. Plays it back. Well, it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Lukaku. Here's Cristante. Romelu Lukaku now. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, space for Inter in the wide position. And a long way out here. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Short corner it is. Barella. Now with Martinez. Can he finish them off? Well, he probably should have done, but couldn't take advantage of the chance. Well, that's a wasteful finish. I just hope he won't be regretting that come the end of the game. Lukaku. Not smooth in possession. Well, what an atmosphere we've got inside this stadium. These supporters are doing everything they can to get their team over the finish line. Well, no danger now. Barella has eyes for goal. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, it just petered out. Well, that would certainly have put the game to bed, but there's still a bit of time left here. From long range. And it took a little nick before it went over the touchline. So a throw in here. And options in the centre. Oh, that's a really good run. Barella. Opportunity. Oh, it's in. And that might be the goal that clinches it for them. No looking back now, surely. There's no credit for winning the ball back. Gorgeous ball from Dybala. They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the visitors. Certainly not their best performance. Well, the thing is, they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. A game that speaks for itself in so many ways.
two terrific teams prepared to give it everything in their quest for glory. It's the kind of match you cannot afford to take your eyes off, even for a minute. A warm welcome on what is a lovely evening for football. Guy Mowbray with you for commentary. Delighted to be joined by Sue Smith. And we've got action for you from Serie A coming up. Your thoughts on this game then, Sue? Cheers, Guy. Well, it's a pleasure to be here. And I'm anticipating a good game today. The coaching staff have done all they can. Now it's about taking it onto the pitch. It's taken a little deflection. Now a throw-in. This is the home side's team today. Yeah, they're playing a 4-3-3. One central striker with the wingers providing the width. A quite narrow three in midfield and then a back four where the full-backs, they're going to be expected to get up and down those flanks. Here's how Juventus line up. Wojciech Szczesny stands between the posts. Federico Gatti plays alongside Bremer as the centre-backs. Weston McKenney starts alongside Manuel Locatelli in central midfield. And up front, Moise Keane plays alongside Arkadius Milik. Federico Gatti. Keane. Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. This is who I've been looking forward to seeing most today. Are we going to see him play a prominent role here soon? Yeah, he pulls the strings, doesn't he? He'll dictate the tempo. A very unselfish player. That's key to the way they play. I can't wait to watch him today. To edge ahead. Oh, that's fabulous for the goalkeeper. Yeah, it is. What a fantastic save that is. He shows great power and agility to get to it. Certainly one for the show reel. Picked out nicely. A terrific tackle. The chance has gone. on the ball there. Lovely weighted pass. Now for the finish. It's in. 1-0. And all the pressure made to count. Clearly the better team to this point. Can't get it through this time. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. Put into the middle. And that's nicely won to see off the threat. Politano, and it's opened up for him. That has gone like a rocket. It's an absolutely wonderful goal. Rabio, onto Keane. Now McKenney. McKenney, and that's two for him today. A superb performance. They can't contain him. Politano. Good run. Now, can he pick out the right option? But it will now be tidied up and cleared away. Keane! And maybe that's a misconnection with the ball. It's well, well wide. The stats show just how many chances they've created, but not enough on target. They've got themselves into great positions. They just haven't tested the goalkeeper enough. You just won't. Oh, what about this? What a stop. Razor shot. Oh, talk about the actions. How good were his then? It's such close range. That's a brilliant save. Juventus have possession again. Rabio. McKenney. 
Locatelli. This could be dangerous. Has to be. And there's another one. Valuable breathing space for them now. Matteo Politano. An attack of genuine promise now. Will it look promising, but only up to a point? Milik. On to Rabio. Real opportunity. Great save. That's what he's there for. I just don't think he can believe that that's not got in, but he's met his match with the keeper. His superb reactions kept that one out. And over the byline, goal kick to come. Politano. Good work to recover possession. Using his strength well. Space now to get a crossover. Now there could be a chance to counter. Is there something at the end? And it's nicely stopped and held by the keeper. Danilo. Some good work to win it there. A chance to cross here. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking really promising. Locatelli. Now Danilo. And the referee's whistle brings the first 40. And the game restarts. He's beaten his marker here. Picks out a teammate. Going for the blast on goal there, but power wasn't the answer. It's missed by a distance. Locatelli. Not so much given away as cleverly won. McKenney. Milik. And that's where it ends, with possession lost. Vicho Kavaratskalia. Oh, good ball in behind. What a chance here. And there's the whistle. It's a penalty. To pull one back. And they have paid the penalty. It's been dispatched. And the game kicks off with the score now 3-2. Milik and it's been cut out there's the turnover oh and he's left his man behind Locatelli and the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing oh excellent vision from a long way out has ended up wide of the target Gatti McKenney and he's won the ball to stop the goal Victor Osimen. Locatelli Weston McKenney Freeman Now Kostic Not forcing the issue, moving the ball nicely 
Well, for all that could have led to something, it won't now. Counter-attack coming, away they go. Anguissa. McKenney. They're not getting close enough here. It's a corner and possibly the chance to go further in front. Something different from the corner. Costage. What a stop! Razor shot! Oh, talk about the actions! How good were his then? It's such close range, that's a brilliant save! Anguissa. Juventus recovering possession well. Keane. Pulls it back. Well, he's kept that out nicely. out of play it'll be a throw now the Vichy Kavarats Kalia Philip Kostic Juve with acres of space to attack it had to be, but the defending ensured it wasn't. Locatelli. A promising looking attack, but it's come to nothing. Well, the crowd is certainly trying to motivate the team to push them forward to get the equaliser. There's a chance for them to go now. They've lost it. A promising break ends there. And a real sense of urgency here. Could they equalise from this? Well, he's lost the ball and any chance has gone. Kenny. Now Kostic. Kostic. Milik. What a chance. Oh, what a miss. That could have sealed it. Oh, I really should have, Guy. And that's a big chance. He just couldn't stay calm when the opportunity arose. A pass that results in a throw in, a little unlucky. A really good interception to take the ball. Could take things forward a notch here. Very quick to close down. And there we are, full time here. They weren't at the very best today and at times were really up against it. But they showed a lot of character to stay in the game and get the right results.
teams heading for what's sure to grab the interest of... Well, hello to you and welcome to another exciting game brought to you by EA TV. I'm Guy Mowbray and Sue Smith is alongside me for commentary and we've got a game for you today from Serie A. What are we going to get from this one, Sue? Yeah, cheers, Guy. It's great to be here. I think it's important that both teams are focused from the off, though, and they start quickly, but I'd love to see some goals. Hopefully I've not just cursed it. Could be something building for Inter here. And that's a shame for them. Nothing doing. This is the Inter starting 11. Jan Sommer is in goal. Stefan de Vrij plays alongside Francesco Acerbi as centre-backs. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Hakan Chalhanolu in central midfield. And they've decided for this one to play with two in attack. They keep on coming. Corner again. Great defending. And behind for a corner. Pressure still on. They opt to go short with the corner. Inter have the ball again. Hakan Chalhanulu. Marcus Turan. In the right position to cut out the pass. Lautaro Martinez. That's a lovely cut inside. Oh, it's still in there. Well, that was looking good, but nothing to come from it. Well, I thought we were going to see an early goal here. And what a start that would have been for them. But the keeper did so well to keep it out. Marcus Turan. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Oh, good ball in behind. And it's nicely stopped and held by the keeper. Hakan Chalhanulu. Chalhanulu. And not getting close enough here. Delivered into the box. But actually just a little too close to the keeper. He'll happily take that. Oh yes, all the practice pays off. Oh, it was well worth a go. But it's gone narrowly wide. Chalhanulu. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? Nearly a wonderful attempt. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he's caught it well. Very unfortunate. De Vrij. Nothing to split the sides, but this move is looking promising. Oh my goodness, what a strike! From so far out, that's absolutely sensational. And the defender left behind. From a long way out, excellent work in goal there, well saved. Alessandro Bastoni. Now Mukitari. Good work from Inter to win back possession. Not quite the accuracy he was looking for. That'll be a goal kick. A chance to get in behind with that. And the flag's up. Offside the call. A turnaround in possession. Excellent positioning. And the defence knew what was coming. Had 
having a look. It's a pretty good save by the keeper. And he's got to clear his lines now. Varela. Marcus Turan. Good work to regain possession. Well, with half-time approaching, the bulk of the crowd won't be happy with how things stand. They've got work to do here. Yeah, it's been a close first half. A few things I'm sure they'll look to reflect on at half-time. Maybe a bit more movement off the ball and making sure the first of those second balls. But they'll be positive they can get something from this. Beautifully weighted ball. Goes for goal! Oh, not a bad try at all. Well, that's unlucky. It's not far away, but they'll be hoping that they don't rue these missed opportunities. Could turn out to be a really good ball. Into very much control in the play in the last 15 minutes. They've carved open the opposition, and if they can get another goal, it does look promising that they'll go on to win the game. Martinez. Now there could be a chance to counter. It's a really good break, this. And the goalkeeper does what he's there to do. Short corner it is. And that'll do it. The second half kicks off, and even if it's only half as good as the first, we're in for a treat. Perfectly anticipated, really well won. work pays off they won the ball Martinez a free kick awarded here the refs viewed that as a foul mm -hmm. the goalkeeper put his positioning right and read that nicely Well, he's made his mark on the game, proving particularly hard to play against. He's causing problems. He'll take this on! Kovicho Kavaratskalia. And the ball has been lost. Lautaro Martinez. DiMarco. Martinez. And it's opened up! Well, he really wound that up, and he was very close to scoring. He's so unlucky not to score. I didn't think he'd shoot from there, but nearly got his reward. Some good work to win it there. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. Barella. And not a lot of respect for fair play there. The ref will surely take action. Oh, off the post. Oh, that's been won really smartly. Pushing forward with options available now. Di Lorenzo. Zielinski. Oh, he tried to put the hammer down on that one, and the result wasn't pretty. Struggling to keep the ball there. Oh, they've lost it. The attack is over. 
Martinez. Martinez. Could be a chance. Safe, but not clear. And the goalkeeper has got it back in his grasp. Well, he's certainly relieved he could gather that, but what a brilliant initial save. Inter have possession again. This is looking good. Now, what comes next? Oh, see, man. And it's a great goal. He couldn't have met that any better. Oh, lovely skill to beat his marker. But that's good defending. Well won. Promising looking attack from Inter. And that's where it ends. That's a lovely ball. There might be something building now. Huge block, but still danger. Varela. And that's pretty straightforward for the keeper. Pass was red and the ball has changed hands. Mkhitaryan. Good ball in behind. Great chance here. And it's in to put them in front. Brilliant. More of that, please. Ossiman and played in deep back post the danger averted for now Francesco Acerbi oh excellent vision and the goalkeeper does what he's there to do so it's a corner and it might be the moment to win the game once and for all There might be a chance to level things. This to level it. And the keeper just about able to deal with the danger. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. Inter showing good width here. That's a good tackle and a throw in to come. All time is looming. What do you make of how it looks? They haven't much time now. Well, it's not over yet, Guy. I just wonder if they can be better with the finishing. They'll need to get that composure in the final third as well, but they have got to be careful that they don't concede again. Bastoni. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? sense that a late equaliser could be on the cards there is the final whistle and it both teams give absolutely everything there was a real intensity to the game but I think the moments of quality just give them the edge and they deserve the results The tension is palpable and you can understand why two high-level sides about to face each other and it's any... And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say.
I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary and my expert analyst as always on these occasions is Stuart Robson I'm directly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A Stuart what are you expecting great defending chance for Dybala oh how about that for a tackle Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Alex Moret is the goalkeeper. Giovanni Di Lorenzo plays with Mario Rui in the fullback positions. Piotr Zielinski plays alongside Stanislav Lobotka in central midfield. And the striker today is Viktor Osimhen. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. And introducing the visitors' lineup today, Brian Cristante starts alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield, and in attack, Romelu Lukaku starts alongside Paulo Dybala. Dybala, oh, great vision, delightful pass. It's with Dybala. And Christensen has it. Gives it a go! Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Taking it forward now, Lukaku. He'll try his luck here. Well, just centimetres over the bar with that powerful shot. Politano Politano using all his defensive acumen to cut it out what can he do with it now Dybala must take the lead here oh he's been denied and they remain Locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Lukaku. Nicely cut out. Victor Ozimhen. Romelu Lukaku now. Well, that's the sign of a well organized defense. A lot of space to attack. That's not a bad ball. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Lobotka. Good through ball. Ongisa. Led that pass all the way, cutting it out. Lukaku. That's a splendid pass from Romelu Lukaku. And beyond the last defender, offside. Ongisa. My goodness, that save. What a stretch he was. One for his own highlight reel. Well, a corner kick it is. Let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage. And beyond the byline, goal kick then. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Mario Rui. Oh, a smart stop. take it on well the goalkeeper is thankful that it wasn't a better effort than it actually was well not quite what he wanted to do with the pass but he's certainly not alone 
Napolitano. And he's in. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Christensen. Authoritative attacking play from Dybala this time. Victor Ozimhen. Has eyes for goal! And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Elects to go short. And a long way out. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Well, nothing comes of it. And he takes it away. Ongisa. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Dybala. Effective challenge. A chance then for... Away they go again. Second half is underway here. No foul play, says the referee. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Getting forward. Has eyes for goal. Oh, my goodness, what a strike from so far out. Absolutely sensational. Unstoppable. And beating the defender. This could be the equaliser. And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Victor Ozimhen. Well, that took confidence. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Lukaku. Very quick thinking there. Dybala. Now, will they do it from here? And a goal! An end-to-end -end game! And they weren't behind for long. Paredes. Romelu Lukaku now. Spinazzola. Back with Lukaku. He's blocked it! Stanislav Lobotka. Andre Frank Zombo Ongisa. And they have possession again. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Excellent defending, but the chance is still on. Decides to shoot. Oh, the post denied him. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Well, they're certainly getting closer. You just sense that the goal is coming. They're playing so well at the moment. Well, having been denied by the woodwork, now the focus is on keeping the opposition at bay. And nicely over the top. And he was being pressed, but did his job. Matero Politano. Onto Nobotka. And having a goal! Well, he hit it with authority. Close. Well, the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football, chances for both teams, and plenty to enjoy. Let's hope for more of the same.
And he stopped them in their tracks. In with a chance. Twenty minutes to go in this one. And credit due, a good intervention. The fans hope so. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. This to give them the lead again. And a goal! He was composure personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Nicely <laughs> timed tackle. Brilliant piece of skill. Di Lorenzo. Not too much elevation in terms of the shot. Christensen. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. And the referee sensibly allowing them to carry on. Advantage with them. Are still pressing for a goal here, but quick thinking defensively. Fine tackle there to prevent a chance. Well, no work for the keeper when all was said and done. So a throw in here. Lukaku. the shot well it's the late show and they are level again run it well Andre Franck Zombo Ongisa trying to get onto the front foot with the minutes ticking away chance here oh a tremendous block Dybala that's a good-looking ball. Dybala, that was untidy. Possession changing hands. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Oh, he's given the ball away. And there's the whistle, all even at the end. The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it and this should be something special on the pitch.
Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, we couldn't worry the keeper with that effort. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Brian Cristante starts alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield. And in attack, Romelu Lukaku starts alongside Paolo Dybala. And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Wojciech Szczesny begins in goal. Weston McKenney starts alongside Adria Rabio in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Inventive and entertaining. It's not a bad combination. Paolo Dybala, the man we're talking about. Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas. Oh, could be. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And responsible for the corner is Dybala. Danger averted. Bremer. Nice looking pass. Oh, Chiesa! That was going in. Dybala. Dybala, determined defending. The object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward. That's what they're doing. Lukaku. And Juve come away with it. Christensen. Potentially a chance to do damage on the flank for Juve. Who's going to win this joust? What a block! Lukaku. Really good interception. Andrea Cambiasso. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? And saved by the keeper. Can someone get on the end of this? Danger still on. Danilo. Vlaovic. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Ndika. Well, we can give them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? Chance for Dybala! Oh, a challenge of the highest order! Dybala! Juventus unable to retain possession. Paredes and a simple clearance a good one not putting so much effort into winning back possession Lukaku oh nice ball over the top Weston McKenney. And the defenders know they need to get tighter. And drawing it back. Rabio. And they might forge ahead. 
Oh, and the decision is penalty. A big chance for them to take the lead here. This to make it 1-0. In it goes! A well-taken penalty! Dybala. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? And diving to thwart him. Well, inching towards half-time, and probably fair to say the fans were hopping. And so near on the volley. Well, he'd be frustrated with that finish. That was a big opportunity there. Lukaku. Dybala. Well, the supporters think it's on. Superb stop. Going short. Dybala. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Dybala. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Juventus keep possession, and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Wonderful chance! And a goal here for Juventus! Surely there's to lose now. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. And so it is. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Spinazzola. It's with Dybala. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Kenny. Oh, Chiesa! Oh, not to be! Stopping a certain goal. And a goal kick is the outcome. Christensen. Here's Cristante. Well, Juventus have it back here. Radio. Dusan Vlahovic. Dybala. Lukaku. Chance for Dybala. And there is the goal. Wow, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Oh, he's gone for goal. And couldn't put it away. Opportunity there to extend their advantage. I have to say, it's not a bad effort. That would certainly made it more comfortable for them. And as they continue to pass it around, the attack goes through Lukaku. And then he goes Chiesa. And it's with McKenney. Back with Chiesa. High quality defending. Excellent vision from Zibala. Lukaku might do damage. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for it. Lahovic. Good ball over the top. Intercepted effortlessly. Threaded through by Lukaku. Interception to snuff out the danger. Federico Chiesa. Plenty of support here. McKenney. That's a good ball. Well, no stopping him. Well, it's open up. What an important piece of defending. Might be a chance to break. Well, they couldn't quite use that break in the manner that they'd hoped.
determined defending. Federico Chiesa. And maybe Rabio. And it's in! The back in front. Stunning scenes here. Brian Tristante. Dybala. And a good looking ball. Well, not to be. He had moved into an illegal position. Well, it's great that he wants to run in behind, but he has to get the timing right. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Promising pass. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. Can they get in behind them? And winning it back. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Vlahovic just sliding back a bit to get on the ball. Good movement, but nothing comes of it. A oh, wonderful bit of skill. Vlaovic, this could finish it. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Well, that save has just about kept them in it but they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Well, they can't exhale just yet. Here they come again. An attack full of promise, and thwarting his opponents in the nick of time. Rabiot. Locatelli. Vlaovic. He cuts it back. we've entered the final five minutes on the attack in the closing phase this could level it but denied by the keeper and at this late stage of the proceedings it could be highly significant well it could be a huge moment Derek so little time left now Lukaku he read the situation defensively and did his job Danilo Cambiasso pass after pass happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents oh that's a super piece of defending and there it is the final whistle not what the home fans were it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. Days of anticipation have led up to this, an occasion where... Welcome along to an evening that was made for football. The pitch is in great order too. I'm Guy Mowbray and Sue Smith is alongside me for commentary. And we've got action for you from Serie A coming up. 
Sue, what are your expectations from this? Thanks, Guy. Well, being in and around the ground before kickoff, the fans are buzzing. They can't wait for this game. So hopefully it's a fast-paced end to... Dybala! And there it is! The opening goal, and what a bright start it's been! Marcus Turan. Kahanulu. Inter pushing forward with options available. Martinez. Martinez! And it's there! The lead didn't last long! They're back level already! Nicolo Barella. Martinez. Can he finish? Oh, they scored again! The game had only just restarted after the last one. Oh, nice vision in that pass. Well, it was looking good, but ultimately nothing doing. And that's a throw-in. They'll have to win the ball all over again. Ibala. Leonardo Spinazzola. Inter regained possession. Nicolo Barella. Now Mukitari. Good patient builder. Chalhanulu. Inter moving the ball around with real purpose. Well, he went for power and got plenty of it, but it's whistled over the bar. Paredes. Ball taken away from them. Barella. Nice, genuine chance. And there's another one. Valuable breathing space for them now. Oh, the beautiful game very much on display. Marcus Turan. Mkhitaryan. Oh, a great chance. Oh, it was set up for the shot, but then he went for brute force when a cool head was needed. And the defender left behind. Oh, it was a why not moment, that. And he wasn't far away. Well, he's certainly full of confidence to attempt a shot from there, and it's really close to going in. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Waited beautifully. Martinez. And it's on now. And the ball has been nicely cut out. Can he finish? Oh, what a, oh, wonderful stop from the keeper. Yeah, he didn't have long to react, but you have to praise his reflexes. DiMarco. Lovely ball. This could lead to something. Perfectly anticipated. Really well won. Lukaku. Spinatola. Has to be. It's there. Hope restored. They're back in this game. Lukaku. Now, what can they do from here? It's saved. Magnificent from the keeper. Oh, that is a great save. It's so close to him. His reactions are quick, and that's really good goalkeeping. They've given it away here. That looks like a good advantage played. Inter with width here. A terrific tackle. The chance has gone. Llorente. Oh, good ball in behind. 
Oh, yes. Timing, technique, a terrific way to score. Paredes. Chalhanolu. Romelu Lukaku. Really nicely played. What can they do with this now? And they went too soon. It's offside. Edging ever closer to goal here. Varela. Great chance here. And further clear they go. There's surely no throwing this one away. Excellent reading of the game to win the ball. Barella. The referee playing advantage. Could turn out to be a really good ball. Oh, that's been won really smartly. Martinez. That's not a bad looking ball. And the keeper more than equal to it. And they take a short corner. And that whistle brings the first half to it. And we're back underway for the second 45. Cristante. Now Dybala. Inter recovering possession well. Henrik Mkhitaryan. Martinez. Could be a chance. Well, it looked promising, but it hasn't proved to be much of a test. Well, he's put in a thoroughly dominant display so far. Absolutely outstanding. Yeah, he's been fantastic, hasn't he? Kept out, but for how long? It stops there. Nothing at the end of it. Varela. Promising looking ball. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Hakan Chalhanurlu. Varela. Marcus Turam. Good work to regain possession. Mkhitaryan. That's a lovely ball. There might be something building now. Untidy in possession there. Varela. Lovely ball. Now what can they do with it? And not getting close enough here. Mkhitaryan. Well, that's how to clear it. And he's hit that from miles out. Nearly a wonderful attempt. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he's caught it well. Very unfortunate. This has to be. It's in. And it's just where he wanted it to go. What a lovely, lovely finish. Mkhitaryan. Beautifully weighted ball. No stopping him yet. Chalhanolu. Mkhitaryan. Really good pass. Mkhitaryan. Terrific point blank save. Well, I thought that had to be a goal, but the keeper pulls off a tremendous save. It's cat like reflexes.
bit sloppy in possession. Oh, what a really good save that was. And it's a short corner. Varela. It might still happen. Well, that's hugely frustrating for the coach and the players. That will be a throw-in now. Paolo Dybala. A chance now for a quick transition. And this could be. He's given it. Penalty. It's going to be a booking as well. Yeah, it had to be. Poor decision. He'll know that. Short. The penalty efficiently put away. Well, it's been a masterclass from Inter so far. And you sense it's a matter of how many they can get. Henrik Mkhitaryan. Martinez. Varela. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. That's not a bad-looking ball. Well, they could have had a great chance. It's offside, but not by much at all. Leonardo Spinazzola. Some good work to win it there. Goes for goal! But that hasn't worked out. Easily gathered by the keeper. Breaking at pace, this could be dangerous. Genuine chance, and there's the hat-trick. He'll be taking the match ball home. <laughs> Henrik Mkhitaryan. Marcus Turam. Varela. And able to come away with the ball. Mkhitaryan Marcus Turan and the work pays off as they get the ball back Lukaku could be dangerous and they've scored this is not yet over they'll have to be quick about it but just one more needed now Martinez Marcus Turan. Varela. They've lost it there, and the attack is over. Well, as soon as they won the ball back there was an almighty roar. The fans are trying to push the team forward and get an equaliser. Now to deliver a good ball in. Puts it back. Corner to come, and a goal here would probably seal it. The corner taken short. And he's having a go. There is the final whistle, and it's Inter. Who... Not the result they wanted, but I've got to say it was against the run of play. They won't mind. It's all about finishing off your chances, and that's exactly what they did. The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it. And this should be something special on the pitch. 
Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray. Excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Now, look at this. They might be able to cash in here. Superbly read and executed. And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Wojciech Szczęsny is the goalkeeper. Adria Radio starts alongside Weston McKenney in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Alex Meret is the goalkeeper. Mario Ruiz starts with Giovanni Di Lorenzo in the fullback positions. Piotr Zielinski starts alongside Stanislav Lobotka in central midfield. And the striker today is Viktor Osimhen. They could nudge in front. And still danger here. What a genuine opportunity. But it was squandered. Goal kick. Anguissa feeding it through oh so close to opening up the defence Vlahovic and now Zielinski has a go oh he comes out with the keeper And deciding to go short with this one. And he's hit it with authority! And what a magical save it was! Short corner favour. Lobotka. What a commitment to defending! Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. It is to be a throw-in. And that's not going to worry the keeper. Federico Chiesa. Dusan Vlahovic. Ongisa, and a long way out. Oh my goodness, what a strike from so far out. Absolutely sensational. Unstoppable. Federico Chiesa. No possibilities inside the box. Great defending. A corner to Juventus, and they need to make something happen. And over it comes. Well, not the best clearance. Danilo. Succeeded in keeping it in play. That's a good-looking ball. Oh, a really untidy loss of possession. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Body in the way again. Ongisa. Shaping to shoot. Just couldn't get it through. Just showing a real will to win the ball. Plenty of forward momentum here. But can they produce? Could be. Oh, it's cheeky. And fired against the crossbar. Well, you can almost feel the goalkeeper's relief. Well, how close was that? The keeper can't believe he's clutching the ball here. Released it nicely. And the right place to cut out the pass. Radio. 
Dusan Vlahovic. Really incisive defending. McKenney. Ozim Hen. Politano. And quick thinking defensively. Kostic. Chiesa. That was going in. Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, the marking was tight. The header off target in the end. Zielinski. Ozim Hen. Has eyes for goal. Well, it wasn't all that far off the target. Well, you're absolutely right. That was close, but the game is still very much in the balance here. Andrea Cambiasso. Well, there it is. Juventus have controlled the possession, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And there goes the whistle, bringing to an end. The start of the second half here in Turin tonight. Now, let's see what they can do here. That's a good-looking ball. And still danger here. And there it is, a goal! I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. A delicious piece of skill. On Gisa. And a very good challenge. Radio. Kostic has it. Space galore for Juventus. Chiesa. Timely intervention. Andre Frank Zombo on Gisa. Lost possession. Politano. Oh, that's fine defensive play. Zielinski. And an astute piece of defending. Radio. What can they do from here? Politano. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Andrea Cambiasso. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, he was under a bit of stress, but back to the keeper. Danilo. Kostic. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Locatelli. Vlaovic. Now with Chiesa. He knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Well, it's a good-looking position. Is there a goal in the future? A real opening now. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Kostic. Mm. 
Locatelli. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. High quality defending. Andre Franck Zombo Ongisa. Counter attacking chance. Well, it was a good counter attack in the making, but very alert defending. Into the final 20 minutes. Well, these Juve fans can sense an equaliser here. Can the players respond? Surely the equaliser. Brilliantly blocked. Stanislav Lobotka. And on to Ozim Hen. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. But timely defending when it mattered. Now, maybe room here for the counter attack. Good through ball. Juventus will have to throw it back in play. Locatelli. McKenney. On to Rabio. Rabio! Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Victor Ozimhen. That's a lovely ball. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Electing to cross into the centre. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Effective challenge. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Federico Gatti. Well, nearly there. This game almost over. And looking at the fans, Stuart, they appear to me to be more than a bit gutted. Well, there's been a real lack of energy right from the start of the game, certainly when they haven't had the ball. Their closing down, decision-making and recovery runs just haven't been good enough. This might be ideal for the counter. And he's in. Oh, great goalkeeping. Well, that's a top-quality save. Great anticipation. And deciding to go short with this one. And a long way out. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Just the clearance that was called for. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Ozim Hen, lovely ball over the top. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Elects to go short. From long range. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment. They were certainly off the pace today, beaten to the board in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. A game that speaks for itself in so many ways.
Thanks for joining us at the San Siro, famously a shared home, and we're delighted to be sharing this with you today. I'm Guy Mowbray, joined by Sue Smith in the commentary position, and we've got a game for you today from Serie A. What are we going to get from this one, Sue? Thanks, Guy. Well, I can't wait for this one. Both sets of fans are certainly up for it. I'm sure that that'll give the players a real boost. They'll be hoping to start the game at a fast tempo. Well, there's the flag. Offside. This is the Inter starting 11. Jan Sommer is in goal. Stefan de Vrij plays alongside Francesco Acerbi as centre-backs. Henrik Mkhitaryan starts alongside Hakan Chalhanolu in central midfield. And they've decided for this one to play with two in attack. Great defending. This is the lineup for the visitors. Yeah, it looks to be a 3-5-2, a defensive formation with the three centre-backs. Three central midfielders giving a strong core to the side. It's just essential that they've got those real athletic wing-backs who can get up and down for the entire game. Promising looking attack from Inter. Struggling to keep the ball there. Nicolo Barella is one of those midfielders who rarely gives you anything less than an 8 or a 9 out of 10 performance. What are we expecting to see from him today, Sue? Well, he's a match winner. He's a genius on the football pitch. Whenever he gets on the ball, you think he's going to make something happen. I love the way he just skips past players with ease. I can't wait to see him play today. And that was not a good effort, nor a good choice. Oh, that's a poor attempt, that. He had other options. And you can see his teammates are frustrated with him for attempting that. A little careless there as the ball changes hands. Could be something building for Inter here. But it will now be tidied up and cleared away. Need to get tighter here. Oh, cheeky attempt. And the keeper more than alive to it. Yeah, well, he's gone for the cute approach here. Just wonder whether it was the right decision in the end. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. Has to be. Still problems for them here. Well, that's a little overhit, and that'll be the keepers. Henrik Mkhitaryan. Well, they're on top here, creating chances too, and the crowd are certainly responding to the good play that they're seeing. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Space now to get a crossover. Varela. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. And he'll have a go here. And that's behind for an inter-corner. The corner taken short. Varela. It had to be, but the defending ensured it wasn't. And that is a vital piece of defending. Into very much controlling the play in the last 15 minutes. They're really taking the game to the opposition. They've had countless opportunities and they fully deserve to be ahead. But it's about taking that next chance when it comes. Nicolo Barella. Barella. Oh, a great chance. That was a chance to open the scoring. Well, that's a huge opportunity to take the lead, and he just doesn't compose himself. You can see the frustration on his face. And getting into a good position. Oh, it was a why not moment, that. And he wasn't far away. Well, he's certainly full of confidence to attempt a shot from there, and it's really close to going in. DiMarco. Pass is incomplete. Nicely won. Moving forward under no real pressure. For the lead here. And they've scored to take a lead that's more than warranted. 
Paraspelia. Marcus Turan. Darmian takes the shot. Oh, he caught that with everything he's got, but it's missed the target, only just too high. Matteo Politano. Some good work to win it there. Trying his luck. And there it is. He's doubled up for the day. So away we go again at 2-0 now. Well, that's how to clear it. Mkhitaryan. Hakan Chalhanurlu. Having a try. And that will do it. The first kick of the second half. The match that's being dominated by Inter. Inter exploiting the space on the flank. And that's a shame for them, nothing doing. Politano. Alessandro Bastoni. Excellent reading of the game to win the ball. Nice bit of defending there to put it out for a throw. It really has been a dazzling display from Lautaro Martinez to this point. He's been wonderful to watch. He's been the standout, the difference between the two teams. And at times he's been unplayable. The goals were clinical and he just looks hungry for more. This is an excellent looking inter transition. Oh, he went for it. It was a wonderful try. A lot of players wouldn't even think of attempting that. But he shows great skill and his effort. It's not far away. What a superb goal that would have been. And a corner to come. They decide against putting it in. And he'll take this on. And it's been kept out by the tips of the fingers. Short corner it is. Good cross into the middle. Well, ambitious effort. That line of attack is stopped. And cleared behind for another corner. Bastoni. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Angisa. Oh, good ball in behind. Di Marco. Federico Di Marco. A really good interception to take the ball. An attack of genuine promise now. And stopped in their tracks with a change in possession. That's a good tackle and a throw in to come. Mario Rui. A bit sloppy in possession. Could take things forward a notch here. Brilliant work by the man in goal. That's a top stop. And they decide against playing it in. From a long way out. And away from danger it goes. Moving forward under no real pressure. And that's where it ends. 
On s'y mène. Varela. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. Anguissa. Oh, he didn't get that right. There could be punishment coming. Martinez. Trying his luck from range here. And that was not a good effort, nor a good choice. Oh, that's a poor attempt, that. He had other options. And you can see his teammates are frustrated with him for attempting that. A move of real promise developing. Decent chance, this. Oh, that's not properly away. And he's done well to punch that clear. Very well kept out, alert and ready. Martinez. And the goalkeeper has got it back in his grasp. Well, he's certainly relieved he could gather that, but what a brilliant initial save. Politano. Politano. In behind, can he finish? It's missed, and they surely won't get a better chance. I don't think they will, Guy. That's a great opportunity to get themselves back into this game. I can't see them getting many more now. Could be dangerous. Maybe not. That was well read to cut it out. Lautaro Martinez. And that's a decent save, at least certainly made to look that way. Into the box it goes. Well, that might have caught the breeze. It's gone all the way out for a throw. Henrik Mkhitaryan. Chalhanolu. And that one is got away. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. DeMarco. Beautifully weighted ball. Now to go a long way with this. And he's got behind it! Hits the upright. And that brings an end to the match with disappointment. So disappointed to lose this. I thought they were the better side. Deserved at least something from the game. But it just wasn't to be. Cameras trained on one man. Well, we know he's a top player. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak.
My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's PSV and they take on RB Leipzig. Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a tight group, so it's vital these teams get off to a good start here. This should be a very competitive game tonight. And the starting 11 for PSV. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And Vies. PSV have given the ball away. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Well, disappointing end to the move. Tese. De Jong. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? And there it is! 1-0! The reference have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. The possession lost, intercepted. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. De Jong uh, winning back possession Leipzig moving the ball forward what can they do from here really have to get it spot on to finish from there and it was miles off target well maybe not the right choice there that's a poor effort Danger averted, well read. And he has options available. <laughs> Pressing like that will help the cause. Jordan Tese feeding it through and the keeper will happily collect that one Paulson and a good tackle Openda De Jong Lozano Can he do it? Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping Playing it in Well, no danger now Has eyes for goal Defending really well. Openda. Really nice ball. Serginho Dest. PSV have given it away.
Lozano. So almost at half time, and they are making good use of home advantage. Still a bit of work to do, though. Stuart, your thoughts on what you've seen? Could be, and denied by the keeper. Impressive. Is it going to end up being productive for them? In a decent position now. Openda. Well, he's certainly not alone. Test. And credit due, a good intervention. The cross is on. That's effective pressure, high up the pitch. And nicely struck. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, as they get the ball running again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. It's got to be! A goal! That's two for him today! They simply can't stop him! No wonder he's celebrating! Jordi Schouten. A very timely interception. Forced into the penalty area. You don't want to give the ball away there. He's given it away. Paulsen. Could be a chance to break here. Schlager. It was an excellent example of how to break at pace. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. They switch on so quickly when they win the ball back. It deserved a goal. Walter Benitez and now Romaglio that can be so difficult to play against a confident passing team when you're trailing and in with a real chance and a goal here there it is they've done it three goals without reply how to dispossess your opponent Powerson Powerson well there was impending danger but good defending and the counter attack is on options available and he was in the right place to intercept And that's great work to keep it in play. He'll take this on. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. Scouten. He'll have a go here. And the keeper more than equal to it. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. And whipped into the box. Well, he got his head on it, but not quite right. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. the challenge that was required <laughs> 20 minutes to go in this one 
They've regained possession. Paulsen. Danny Olmo with it. Just failing to hit the target. Good effort, though. Well, that's one for them to pursue. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Really good build-up, but no end product. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. That's a good-looking ball. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Simmons. Oh, splendid skill. And the ball back with Leipzig now. De Jong. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Vital intervention. Well, he's gone back to give the free kick, the referee here. He tried to play advantage, but it didn't accrue. Can they put it away? And snuffing out the danger. Throw in for PSV. Well, you've got to conclude that it was completely overhit. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Lozano. Credit to them for winning back possession. Now, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Well, it looked so promising, but it all comes to nothing. An attack full of promise. Nicely timed tackle. Danny Olmo. And thwarted there, following the cross. And that will be all. It's a disappointing start from a Leipzig. Well, we tend to take for granted production from Erving Lozano. That's what we got. How would you summarise his contribution, Stuart? Well, he fully deserves the match ball. He was outstanding today, both with his... A game of colossal importance and a stadium packed to the rafters. We can't ask for any more. How could... Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome.
I'm Derek Ray getting ready to bring you all the action accompanied by my broadcasting partner Stuart Robson and this is where it all starts in the U and it might be can he take advantage splendid defending this is how it looks for the home side Alex Meret is the goalkeeper. Giovanni Di Lorenzo plays with Mario Rui in the fullback positions. Piotr Zielinski starts alongside Stanislav Lobotka in central midfield. And the striker today is Viktor Osimhen. Well, here's how the lineup looks for PSV. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Not really the high percentage option to try your luck from there. Well, his teammates aren't particularly happy. He was never going to score from there. Joey Fairman return to Lozano De Jong can they forge ahead well they've solved the problem he can't hold on to it one terrific save after another and it wasn't what the keeper was trying to do but it has gone straight out of play well what a chance that was to take the lead but you have to give the goal oh, look at this Stuart an opportunity oh the crossbar is still reverberating a goal in the early stages, precisely what they had been planning. Fairman. Lozano. Very quick thinking there. Excellent strike! Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. In position! And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Able to skip past his man. Politano. Well, he was on his own. He had the goalkeeper to beat, but failed to do so. Well, he just needed to show a bit more composure there. Take a little bit off the shot, I think. Gustil. Oh, moving it nicely. Oh, that's fine defensive play. Good looking run. Politano and keeping it out. And having a goal! Oh, a smart stop. Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. No one able to do any damage with it. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business. A really vital interception. And space to exploit, maybe. Oh, he's given it away inexplicably. Politano did well to win the ball back can't miss surely they've gone and scored again they're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back really bright looking attack 
Quality of players waiting in the middle. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Zielinski. A very effective challenge put in. Ozim Hen. Thwarting him. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. They're putting all their energies into winning back possession. Juan Jesus. Matero Politano. Well, nicely cut out. Well, that's eye-catching wide play. Just missing narrowly on the volley. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he caught it so well. He's unfortunate. Oh, he's gone for goal. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. A chance then for the respective managers to address... Away they go again. Second half is underway here. High quality defending. Good ball over the top. And intercepted it. Dest. and unable to keep the ball Ongisa and now with Di Lorenzo definitely look as though they want to make this move count well he's been ruled offside Zielinski and he saw the situation developing and losing possession and threading it through chance great defending player on the way again De Jong oh he's left his marker for dead a good and fair challenge Politano took a nick on the way through so a corner here well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Gus Thiel. And De Jong on the ball. Good weight on that pass. Rosano. Can he convert? The save was a good one. Effort from long distance. Well, it would have taken perfect technique from that sort of range. And that was less than perfect. Uh, not a good decision from him. That's a waste of possession there. Putting his body on the line. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. And nicely struck. Can't get the shot through. Really good build up, but no end product. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Si ricorda ai tifosi che il calendario completo degli impegni della propria squadra, comprese tutte le partite amichevoli, è presente. 
Jody Scouten. He's got space. Lozano. What a commitment to defending. Well, there to intercept. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. We wondered who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Beautiful pass. Oh, that's really untidy. Just steal. And possession changing hands. Ozim Hen. And he takes on the shot. Oh, fine stop. And over comes the corner. Well, he failed to get it away properly. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. And intercepts again. Oh, great vision. Takes the shot. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Oh, magnificent save. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. And he takes on the shot. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Giovanni Di Lorenzo and now Juan Jesus Mario Rui released it nicely very quick thinking there not a huge chunk of added time one minute that's a good pass And there goes the final whistle. Well, the occasion and all week long the football well just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening it's absolutely ideal i'm derek ray and with me here on the commentary box is stuart robson 
and we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League. The group stage, Matt, great opportunity, a smart stop here. The chance might be on for him. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. That's a lovely ball. No nonsense clearance. Well, here's how the lineup looks for PSV. Well, it's a back four, a narrow midfield three, and a very disconnected front three. But if the midfield players give good support to the central striker, this 4 3 3 system could work really well today. Diogo Gonzalez. Continues his run. And he takes it on. Well, it ended up being easier for the goalkeeper in the end. Well, he really is danger personified. But in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-tubes around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Fairman. Take it away. Le Rager. Victor Klaasson. And the Hager has it. Oh yes, what a pass. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. De Jong. Has eyes for goal. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. Oh, he's given us away. Might work out. the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick oh he looks threatening and the keeper there to deal with it well sometimes they come off for you sometimes they don't Stuart well he didn't get the technique right there and as a result he mistimes the contact on the ball Oh, tremendous vision. Nicely timed tackle. Luke de Jong. Back to Lozano. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. Angles it back. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Lozano. De Jong. And return to De Jong. Could be. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing. And now they sense victory. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Le Rager. Trying to open them up. Wonderful chance. And there is the goal. Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now.
Virgo Solberg Melling. Victor Klasson. Good looking sequence. Nice weight on the pass. Untidy in possession. Can he take advantage? Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. They won't complain about having won the corner and maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Rasmus Falk. Elianusi. Elianusi. A chance to whip it in. Well, there's the pullback. Well read to ease the pressure. on it, good goalkeeping and just one minute of time added on for stoppages read it well and with that the first half draws to a close so the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway Diogo Gonzalez. And they know they need to stop him. And let's give credit to the defending. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter attack. Oh, genuine chance. And a goal! Cause for celebrations again. Two in front. This could be troublesome. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Offside. Well, he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there. Just let the ball be played into the space. Chance to cross. And he got to it fairly easily. Good ball to switch the play. Creative look about this. Not to like about that pass. Opportunity. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Diogo Gonzalez. Well, they've lost the ball. And space for him to cut in. Now, who can he pick out? Beautifully weighted ball. But the flag goes up offside. Well, he just needs to play that a bit sooner. The pass was definitely on. Well, showing good vision. Crossing into the middle. And the danger is averted. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Oh, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. And nicely over the top.
And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Glass on. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Oh, terrific free kick, and how well the keeper did to parry it. Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Well, opportunity missed just when we wondered if things were going to change for them. Well, this should have been a goal, and boy, do they need it. Gustil. And he could really get at the opposition. Committed challenge. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Fairman could be dangerous. Good looking move. And he's only gone and made it a hat trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance! And with that, the attack fizzles out. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. It is a decent looking attack here. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. A good and fair challenge. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Might work out. But I'll tell you what, that didn't miss by much. So a throw in here. And showing fine vision. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. De Jong. Just the challenge that was required. And there it is, the final whistle. It ends in... And we tend to take for granted production from Erving Lozano. That's what we got. How would you summarise his contribution, Stuart? Well, his movement was brilliant today. Whether he was running in behind or dropping into... Cameras are fixed to one man. 
Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique, and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. Good evening to you from a city that has become one of Germany's most visited in recent years. We're in Leipzig. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Well, the first game of the group is so vital. You just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. High quality defending. And here's how Leipzig will line up. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Alex Meret is the goalkeeper. Giovanni Di Lorenzo plays with Mario Rui in the fullback positions. Piotr Zielinski starts alongside Stanislav Lopotka in central midfield. And the striker today is Viktor Osimhen. Good weight on that pass. Well, I'm not sure the keeper particularly wanted that, but danger averted for now. Ikoma Luis Openda. Haidara. Pausen. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Ogisa. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Well, not every player is capable of that sort of thing. Full marks for trying. Shame about the execution. Danny Olmo. And Leipzig in a position of menace. Really well hit, but just too much height on it. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Mario Rui. Beautiful pass. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Danny Olmo. Possession changing hands. Aidara. He'll have a go here. Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of plus, but it wasn't a great effort. Juan Jesus. Lobotka. And now Zielinski. Well, can they be creative from here? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And goes for goal! Well, when all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Lobotka. And now with Ozimhen. Good visualisation and execution. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Lobotka. A really good pass. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Leipzig pushing forward with options available. It's an opportunity. Leipzig with the ball again. 
Schlager. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Well, not coming close to hitting the target from there. Well, as the stats confirm, the game hasn't got going so far and the attack in play from both sides has been really poor. But some credit must go to the defenders because they've dominated here today. And that's an important intervention. Politano and crossed in there. And he could be in proper trouble here. And a goal! Now they've broken through. 1-0 here. And great work to confuse the defender. Victor Ozimhen. Well, it clearly was deflected, so it will be their throw-in. On a pass that lacks quality. Ozim Hen. Ozim Hen. And that is going to do it. That is good. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Openda. Attacking possibilities for Leipzig. A disappointing end to the move. That's a lovely ball. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Still possibilities. And held by the keeper at the second time of asking. Well, he's just pulled off a great first save there. Now they can all calm down. Mario Rui. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half. Scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good. And he got better as the half wore on. Giovanni Di Lorenzo could be dangerous but ably intercepted when it looked as though they might be in well doesn't have to do it on his own Paulson oh to level the match off the post and back in play well, it's coming. I feel sure of that. Leipzig just need to be a bit more clinical. And he takes on the shot. Just can't get it past him. Paulson. Danny Olmo with it. Just the challenge that was required. Able to skip past his man. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? And the counter looks on here. Options available. That's a good ball. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Simmons. chance a goal real excitement a back and forth type of game now they're level oh he's given the ball away Simacon teammates available he read the situation defensively and did his job. Openda. Going well. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising.
from one side of the pitch to the other. Can he play it in? Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, he's given it away. Danny Olmo. There to take it away. Released it nicely. He's got to score! Oh, well hit, but couldn't keep it down. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Oh, nice ball over the top. Mario Rui. And possession lost by Leipzig. Is it going to end up being productive for them? In position. Oh, such an elegant finish. How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. Well, no time to waste. Can they find an equaliser? Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Not the worst free kick in the world, but the goalkeeper equal to it. Well, this might be their final opportunity to draw level. Has a go. And able to close down the shot. Nonsense clearance. Danny Olmo. Can he convert? Well, the goalkeeper making a big contribution and denying him another one. Well, it's another chance for him, as you said. He looks so hungry for goals today. Stanislav Lobotka. Victor Ozimhen. Good looking sequence. Can he finish them off? Still could be dangerous. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, he's certainly not alone. Well, giving it a go in a bid to haul them back into this one. Well, they're knocking at the door here, but they need to score soon. Stanislav Lobotka. Andre Frank Zombo Ongisa. Mario Rui. That's not a bad ball. And in the end, no damage done. So full time it is, and a morale boot. There have been days of eager anticipation prior to this match. Good evening to you from a city that has become one of Germany's most visited in recent years. You're in Leipzig. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. 
And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's RB Leipzig facing FC Copenhagen. Well, the first game of the group is so vital. You just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. And he has the measure of his man. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, they fancy a short one. El Yanusi. And a very good challenge. Openda. Lasson and it's with Gonzalves firing it towards goal but the keeper takes charge and it was pretty straightforward Aydara clear to see who got the last touch so a throw in it'll be options in the middle long way out right out of the top drawer Elianusi takes on the shot it looked as though it had a chance of going in for the equaliser it was close, it's a decent effort just need to keep plugging away now and surely the goal will come a really good pass Well, that's how to beat your opponents. Oh, surely! Oh, my word! There's excellent timing for you. What a challenge! Victor Klasson. Will he finish? Tremendously strong in the tackle. Simmons. You new see real chance and denied by the keeper impressive and second time around he scores but the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing not high quality defending and plenty of room in the wide area and hit with ferocity It is to be a throw-in. Larson. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. But he keeps going. Oh, he'll take it on. And what a magical save it was. And taken short. From long range. take on that shot absolutely brilliant Elianusi and space for them here could play it in comes to nothing in the end Good run and good ball control. Can he put it in? Oh, good save. And deciding to go short with this one. Going to get a try. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. In the short corner, let's see. get it through so you just possess your opponent released it nicely and he's hit it with authority not troubling the keeper 
Openda. That's eyes for goal. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Leraga. And the emphasis is on creativity. Big chance. Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Using space on the opposite flank now. A oh, tremendous vision. Intercepted effortlessly. Class on. Openda, not looking all that comfortable on the ball. Ikoma Luis Openda. Takes aim, and a really powerful effort, but just over the top. Well, the referee not messing about, he's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. That is that for the first half. He... Well, the second half underway, and it really was a big statement made by Leipzig in the first half. Will there be a response in the second? danger here as he runs at them must be under pressure can he finish and there it is but hang on the flag has gone up and it's not going to count well it was a close call but he is just offside good finish mind you and a shot from some way out and he got to it fairly easily Elianusi really good challenge Good move in the making from Leipzig. Elianusi. Crossing possibilities. And a textbook interception. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Promising pass. Can they keep it going? Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Did well to win the ball back. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. Falk. Promising possession, this. No real threat, you've got to say. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Well, Leipzig just can't dominate the possession, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Oh, big opportunity! And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! And space for them here on the flank. Oh, fine stop! And a tidy challenge. Pulls it back, might lead to a chance, and a goal this time, applying the finishing touch, just what the doctor ordered. Simons, a oh, good vision there. In 
Decisive pass. Could reduce the deficit. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Paulson played into the centre. And quick thinking defensively. 20 minutes to go in this one. Read it superbly to take back possession. Well, a swift challenge and a throw-in coming up. And the keeper more than equal to it. And deciding to go short with this one. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Long way out this. Well, it wasn't quite as dangerous as I thought it might be. Elianusi. Decent looking pass. Well, he so badly wanted to net another one. But the keeper playing his part. Well, maybe that should have been his second, but you can see another one coming. He's playing so well here. And it might be. Well, let's give him credit for trying it, but the execution left a bit to be desired, Stuart. Well, I think the idea was right. Unfortunately, the skill wasn't. It's well off target in the end. Oh, breezing past him. The delivery. a go and what a magical save it was short corner taken that is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances and pressing really high oh that's a really good pass takes on the shot the crossbar got in the way well it looked as though it might be problematic for the keeper and the defenders but they've got away with it well he eventually clutches the ball but they've got lucky here that really looked like being a goal didn't it nicely timed tackle and the counter attack is on options available a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it Well, sadly, you've got to say, it all went horribly wrong for him. Well, he backed his technique. Unfortunately, on this occasion, it let him down badly. That's a poor effort. Perfect tackle. Elianusi. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. David Raum. And I must say, that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. And there it is, the final whistle. It ends in... Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, he was on fire today, not just with his finishing, but also his general play. That was a top-class hat-trick.
heading for a showdown. Two teams. Good evening to you from a city that has become one of Germany's most visited in recent years. We're in Leipzig. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's RB Leipzig against PSV. Well, the first game of the group is so vital, you just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. Perfect tackle. And here's how Leipzig will line up. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, if they're going to play as a 4-4-2, they must make sure they stay compact out of possession and then stretch the pitch when they do have the ball. How they play in transition is going to be key today. And the keeper got there and comfortably. And that a play for a Leipzig throw-in. But he has tremendous vision and skill and they're delighted that he's out there on the pitch. Talking, of course, about Danny Olmo. How might he influence this game? Well, if they get any free... Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And deciding to go short with this one. And ties for goal! Leipzig couldn't keep it. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. an interesting pass but they're not being allowed to continue it's offside well he had the vision to pick out the pass but he couldn't play it quite quickly enough Schouten and there it breaks down but credit to the defence Jordi Schouten Chances on, pounds away by the keeper. Well, they might be piling on the pressure, but they've got to make it count in those situations, that's for sure. Well, attacks are plenty, but now defensive resilience is what's called for. Very quick thinking there. Might work out. Flag raised for offside. And he has options available. Oh, that's a really good run. And that is defending of the highest order. And fed forwards. De Jong. To put them ahead. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Beautifully weighted ball. Showing ambition. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Kezi in a decent position now. That's a well-struck pass. Joey Fairman. Leipzig regaining possession. That's a good ball. And the problem not completely solved. And problem solved for now. Could be dangerous. Must be. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Paulsen. That's a good pass. 
But the flag goes up offside. Well, he just needs to play that a bit sooner. The pass was definitely on. Luc de Jong. Well timed tackle. Lozano. De Jong. Wonderful chance. A oh, great challenge, but not out of the woods. Schlager. Well, very shortly we'll hear the half-time whistle, and Leipzig have a lot of... Oh, he's in behind them here, Derek. Well, capable of so much better, to be honest. Well, I expected more as well, Derek. I thought from that sort of position, he had every chance of scoring, but it's a poor effort. Lozano. Will it be? Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Luke de Jong. Oh, it might be. That is that for the first. And off and running again. There was a real gulf in class in the first 45. Will we see an improved effort from Leipzig in the second? Jody Schouten. That's a good looking ball, but how well he did to react in that manner. And he stopped them in their tracks. And hit with ferocity! Goalkeeper getting in the way, superb save. And going for goal! And the shot was always rising, goal kick. Posen. PSV regaining possession. Putting his body on the line. Trying to open up the defence. Oh, superb save. Massive credit to the keeper. Well, he's so hard to beat in these situations. It's brilliant goalkeeping. Teze. And De Jong on the ball. Oh, nice ball over the top. Oh, that's a fine save. <laughs> and that'll be a Leipzig throw-in. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. PSV have given the ball away. Oh, good strike! Well, marginally wide. So, so close. Serginho Dest. Pearman. Now, what can they produce on the flank? Dangerous ball. Well, a suspect piece of finishing when all is said and done. And he'll be thinking about that for quite some while. That's a tame finish. Well, great read there to intercept. Lozano. Oh, tight offside decision. But the flag does go up. the perfect position to read it
And a struggle for PSV to retain the ball. Really good build up, but no end product. Oh, that's a fine looking pass. A goal here, giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Luke de Jong. In with a chance. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Luke de Jong. Fairman. Might work out. No way through. Has eyes for goal. Now in a more than decent position. Oh, this is looking promising, but a good piece of tidying up. Olivier Boscalier. And the counter looks on here. Options available. De Jong. That's a good ball. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. And easily intercepted. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, it wasn't a taxing save. Unable to keep it, PSV. Oh, what an opportunity. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Going well. Timely intervention. Pretty straightforward for the keeper. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Jordan Teze. And that will be all. It's a just. of the moment. 
Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. Stuart, what are you expecting? Well, the first game of the group is so vital. You just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, it's a back four, a narrow midfield three, and a very disconnected front three. But if the midfield players give good support to the central striker, this 4 3 3 system could work really well today. Can he put it in? A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Politano. Politano. And now with Ozimhen. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. He's in with a chance. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. PSV have given it away. Ongisa. They had to react and did. Can they take advantage? Good looking move. Brilliant save. And very deftly cut out. Well, the fans are happy with what they're seeing at the moment. They're urging their team on here. And a good looking ball. Still a chance. Managed to get it out of there. Distributing it well. Really good build up, but no end product. Gustil. De Jong. Nice weight on the pass. Oh, a smart stop. Lobotka. And pressing from the front. Ozimhen and threading it through and in oh yes exactly what they were hoping to produce they've delivered the goal Victor Ozimhen and nicely struck well catching it sweetly but not quite the accuracy he was looking for well it's always a difficult technique on the volley but i think that's a massive chance he should score from how about the cross there's the cut back must score well, that was a guilt-edged opportunity for the equaliser. Well, I'm not sure how he's missed the target from there. That's a poor effort. Ozim Hen. Having to shoot. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. And there's the delivery. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Luc de Jong. Can he find the right pass? Can he get them level? And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Luc de Jong. Opportunity here. Magnificent defending. An important interception.
Onguisa. Di Lorenzo. Now with Politano. A very timely interception. Luke de Jong. Really good interception. De Jong. Then to the goalkeeper. Juan Jesus. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Politano. That's not a bad ball. Can he finish here? Oh, that is a majestic goal. Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. Trying to open up the defence. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long, and this match is level again. Great vision to switch the play. Nicely timed tackle. And with that, the first half draws to... So the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Who can he pick out? Ongisa. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. And that is a free kick artist at work what a goal it was Fairman Lozano now Luke de Jong the cut back genuine chance they just couldn't stay in front and now this match is all square Lobotka and he's won the ball ball back with PSV now nice looking pass Politano might jump in front well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Gustil. Joey Fairman. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Zielinski. Mario Rui. Now with Zielinski. Easy save. Serginho Dest. And room now out on the wing. And let's give credit to the defending. Incisive pass. He's trying to create something, and the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Decent looking pass. Read that pass all the way, cutting it out. And fed forwards. Opportunity here. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. 
Augustil. Must be a goal! That's two for him today! They simply can't stop him! No wonder he's celebrating! A danger here as he runs at them. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Into the final 20 minutes. And he read it well defensively. Crossing possibilities. Chance here. And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession. No wonder they're celebrating. PSV have given the ball away. On the offensive. Could play it in. Zielinski. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Ongisa. Rui. Well, giving it a go in a bid to haul them back into this one. Well, they're knocking at the door here, but they need to score soon. Spot on with that tackle. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Have to pay attention defensively. Just can't get it past him. A bit wasteful from PSV. Opportunity it is. And deflected behind, so a corner here. And a goal! Fasten your seatbelts. This is not in the bag just yet. They know what they need, and that's an equaliser here. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Well, we've entered the final five minutes. Determined defending. So a throw in here. So almost at full time, and the home side on course to eke out a narrow win. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, going forward, they've been excellent, but they've also been too open at the back. They certainly haven't won this yet. And it's a quality pass. Oh, so close to opening up the defence. This could level it. No way through. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. And there goes the final whistle. Well, they've...
city alive with the spirit of excitement and a stick. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner as usual is Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's PSV facing FC Copenhagen. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a brilliant save. They favoured a short one here. Denis Vavro. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. Well, trying to build ahead of steam. Another corner it'll be. Favouring the short one. Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. Schouten. And easily intercepted. De Jong. Nice. Can they take the lead? Oh, blocked it. A wilting under the pressure. And now they try to go forward. Lozano. Just couldn't get it through. Lozano and the referee sees that as a foul free kick given Lozano just the challenge that was required Virgo Solberg Melling really fine piece of defending play to break it up Incisive pass. Gustillo. And that puts them in position. He's managed to get in behind. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out the danger. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. Pulls it back. And it's in! This could be troublesome. Gustil. He must finish. Terrific piece of anticipation. Might really be able to trouble them here. Rasmus Falk. Real chance. Lozano has eyes for goal. Well, it ended up being easier for the goalkeeper in the end. Opportunity. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing. And now they sense victory. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Well, threat about it. Seal. And PSV unable to retain possession. Great block. Well, spot on with that challenge. Well, he's certainly not alone.
Elianusi. And that is how to block. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Joey Fairman. Determined defending. Moving forward effectively. Is this the moment? And a good take under duress there. Luke de Jong, clean challenge. And de Jong on the ball. Oh, that's a really good run. There's the chip. And foiled only by the crossbar. Well, they just can't get back into this game. The woodwork on that occasion just denying them. Well, that's not watertight defending. And nicely parried away. And behind it's gone for a corner. Favouring the short one. Electing to shoot. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Oh, he's given us away. Jordan Teze. Glass on. And passing it well. Well, couldn't keep it in. And possession lost by PSV. Lozano. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. He's foiled them on his own. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Lozano. That's a good looking pass. Oh, great block. Elianusi. And it's with Laraga. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Lozano. Class on. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. 30 minutes to go then. And he has options available. Well, a long distance effort and a highly respectable one, Stuart. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. It's a decent effort, you have to say. Well, as those stats tell us, their attacking play today has been exceptional. Defenders have come out at the right time. The midfielder completely dominated the game. And the front player's movement has been excellent. Yes, they're having a field day in attack. And here they come again. Plays it back. Genuine chance. Oh, incredible. Oh, just look at that. I don't mind saying that is out of this world. Spectacular. Well, there's an example of how to press high up. Can he find the right pass? Birger Solberg-Melling. 
Looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, they couldn't quite use that break in the manner that they'd hoped. Well, good run and good ball control. Couldn't hang on to it, PSV. De Jong. Oh, could be. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Nice weight on the pass. And just wide of the post. Yeah, decent effort, but not one that was going to trouble the goalkeeper, I don't think. 15 minutes left for play. Luc de Jong. Not to like about that pass. And possession lost there. Can they take advantage? Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Virgo Solberg Melling. And it's with Gonzalves. And slipped through beautifully. And having a goal! Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. Luc de Jong. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Is this the moment? And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. And tremendous individual skill. Well, they know they need to stop him. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Denis Vavro. Rasmus Falk Jensen on the ball. Le Rager. Perfect challenge. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Is it going to be? And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. He has teammates around him. Can he take the chance? Still alive. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Luc de Jong and the ball in behind the defenders and a goal they just keep believing so full time it is and a Marat
The day is here. The match everyone has been talking about. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Poor attempt at a pass, really. So the initial 11 for the home side. Alex Meret is the goalkeeper. A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Politano. touch well that was a great save but the way they're playing at the moment the equaliser can't be far away now not unlucky perhaps to be denied but they've now got to think about defending and that a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end Envies, now delivering that deep cross, but it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. And nicely over the top, and steered back under a bit of pressure. And all the way through it goes to the goalkeeper. Politano. Politano. It's a good cross. Has to be. And he's done it. Parity again. A magnificent game unfolding. And possibilities here. It's there for him. Magnificent defending. Matero Politano. They couldn't maintain possession. Zielinski. Di Lorenzo. On to Politano. No let up here. And angling it back. Can they forge ahead? And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Simmons. Openda. Powerson. Well, putting it wide from there. Disappointing. Not smooth in possession. Simmons. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Housen. Not the best clearance. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Well, very effective play in possession. Well, let's open up. The book cut. Well read to ease the pressure. Paulsen. Paulsen. And the shot just over the top. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. And Politano with it.
Juan Jesus onto Lobotka not getting anxious when they have the ball and Leipzig with the ball again delivered into the area here well the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend well had that gone in the game was firmly in their hands now though they've got to make sure they don't let this slip Giovanni Di Lorenzo well that's the sign of a well organised defence Paulson oh breezing past him an alert piece of defending Ozin Hen firing it towards goal well I must admit it didn't trouble the keeper to the extent that I thought it might well they know they need to stop him well didn't go to plan in the end and there it is the Well, the ball is moving again. It's advantage Leipzig after the first 45, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns before this one is over. Ozim Hen. On to Rui. Zielinski. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. And the referee sensibly allowing them to carry on. Advantage with them. Feeding it through. Almost found its target. But cutting it out in the end. A really good pass. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. On Gisa. He's got to score! Oh, not to be! Stopping a certain goal! Oh, nice ball over the top. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And teammates to play it to. And space for him to cut in. Tries to lift it. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Lobotka. Well, the last over hit. Not quite what he wanted to produce. An important interception. Has the strength to hang on to it. Lobotka. Moving the ball forward. How creative can they be? Can they nudge in front? Brilliantly blocked. Really good challenge. Into the advanced position. Envies. Now with Pausen. Oh, it's a terrific challenge. Really good ball there. And the alarm bells are ringing. Now just the tackle that was needed. Lobotka can he make it count oh body in the way crucially will this corner bear fruit for them will they be oh it's gone in a significant deflection leaving the keeper flummoxed Bolton and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end
Simmons. And that is a below par pass. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Now, will the cross work out for them? Appear to be in two minds. Lobotka. It did look on for them, but not to be. Leipzig pushing forward with options available. Real chance. Stopped a surefire goal. Maybe a potential opportunity for Leipzig to equalise here. Excellent defending. Just 15 minutes remaining. He's in behind. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. Mario Rui. Did well to win the ball back. Paulson. Showing ambition. Well, that was a very respectable effort from such a long way out. Well, he hits it cleanly and it's a very good strike, but just not on target. Victor Ozimhen. Boritano. Well, not cleared away completely. And in the end, no damage done. Counter-attacking chance. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Ozim Hen. Not really the ideal clearance. And a time for calm on the ball. And he was being pressed, but did his job. Read it well. And there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Palmed away by the keeper. And there we have it, the final whistle. for a showdown two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big and good evening on what is a perfect night for football the floodlights shining down on the players as we speak
My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. Well, you don't really want to be picking up a caution so early in the game, Stuart. Well, he's going to be under pressure now. That was a reckless challenge. He didn't need to make it at all. He'll have a go here. And just over the bar, really good effort. And tidily played. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Skipping away. Now, that's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? But the keeper able to turn it away. A stunning stop. Aydara. He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. Leipzig being afforded too much space. Long way out there. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. It's a corner. And the shot. Stopped a surefire goal. Well, conceding the throw in. Good challenge. Birgo Solberg Melling. Denis Vavro. And they have possession again. Good looking move this. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Keen to take it short here. It's a fierce effort. Making sure it didn't get past him. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Victor Klasson. Crossing possibilities. He's got to score! And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Promising sequence. A chance, perhaps. He's blocked it. Simmons. Envies. And hit with ferocity! Well, the keeper is happy the bar was there. And a time for cool heads. Well, Leipzig are getting close. That, that was so unlucky. They're looking dangerous now. Moving into the advanced position. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Paulson trying his luck and denied by the keeper impressive taken short let's fly here well he couldn't quite hit the target Stuart well it's a decent effort but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper Virgo Solberg Melling clear to see who got the last touch so a throw in it'll be Diogo Gonzalez still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead options in the centre promising pass really vital interception here 
Now can they counter clinically? Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And that's going to roll all the way through. Mopping up defensively. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Not really the high percentage option to try your luck from there. Well, his teammates aren't particularly happy. He was never going to score from there. Diogo Gonzalez. It's with Melling. Leipzig doing well to regain possession here. Pausen. Le Rager. But it stopped a promising attack in its tracks. And you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. And goes for goal! It was an accurate free kick, but a fine save. Danny Olmo. Well, could be in hot water here, booked already. And he whips it in. Well, catching it sweetly, but not quite the accuracy he was looking for. Well, it's always a difficult technique on the volley, but I think that's a massive chance he should score from. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Kevin Dix. And the whistle is sounded for... So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. And quick thinking defensively. What can they do from here? And caught by the keeper. Schlager. Out of play and a lighty throw in coming up. Well, Yusuf Paulsen was on his game in the first half. I wonder what you made of him. Well, he stepped forward for his team with the equaliser. It could prove to be the key turning point in this contest, as they haven't been at their best today. You do feel they need to find another gear in the second half, though, if they are to go on and win it. The crossbar got in the way! Well, that was a bit unlucky, because you just get the feeling they need to make the most of one of these chances. Well, it should boost their confidence, but they can't afford to drop their guard at the other end. No way through! Well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. It comes to absolutely nothing. Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Well, no wonder he's smiling. It didn't quite come off for him, though. Openda. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Well, the hosts have dominated the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes, and they're playing really well and creating chances. It's surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here. He read the situation defensively and did his job.
Falk not showing good vision well unfortunately not very convincing at all with that effort well he made a mess of that just didn't make a good connection did he and the danger is averted good move in the making from Leipzig well the keeper had to think about it for a moment but too high Falk and a strong tackle And that's very intelligent play to win back possession. Able to get a body in the way. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Paulson. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Attacking possibilities for Leipzig. But really sticking to the task defensively. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Well, a shot from miles out. And simple for the keeper. His determination there for all to see. Simakon. And now here's Henrichs. Aydara. Good distribution. Danger averted. A very timely interception. Excellent strike! Clear to see who got the last touch. So a throw in it'll be. And space to cross it. And quick thinking defensively. Ten minutes to go. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. And a throw in it's going to be. And well, they've given him too much space. That's a routine take. Amadou Haidara. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Oh, he's gone for goal. And just narrowly wide in the end. Icoma Luis Openda. That's a lovely ball. Well read to win possession back. Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Well, they survived the attack. Elianusi. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. And a goal at this stage might well turn out to be decisive. Well, he's beaten his opponent. And there's the referee's whistle. Still all...
nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium, especially when there's so much on the line. Hello and a warm welcome to the Balmer section of Amsterdam. We find ourselves here at the Johan Cruyff Arena. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary board, goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. And knocked out of there. Well, here's the starting lineup for Ajax. Well, in this formation, it's the fullbacks who have to get forward to provide the width because the midfield and front players stay very narrow. But it should allow them to control the middle of the park where they are dominant. In search of space. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. An alert piece of defending. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Genghis Under plays with Dusan Tadic out wide. And the lead striker today is Edin Dzeko. Given away by Ajax. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. Dzeko, chance! Oh, that is outrageously spectacular! Well, a flair for the dramatic, to say the least. We'll be replaying that one over and over again for a long time to come. Steven Bergwijn. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Well, as you can hear, the fans think that should have been a penalty, but I'm not convinced. And it's opening up. And that's a straightforward stop. Bonna Sosa. Well, no way through. Can they trouble the opposition this time? A well, disappointing end to the move. Henderson. A room to roam on the wing. Firing it towards goal! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Worth a try. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Berghaus. Well-timed tackle. Kadioglu. Oh, nice ball over the top. Chance here. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. David Berghaus. Ajax looking dangerous. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. A long way out. Well, that is how to strike a free kick, and that's how to make a save. It's a corner. Struggling to get it away. Well, a textbook interception. And Fenerbahce couldn't keep it. Superb block. And again, negligence when in possession. Could pull one back here. Full marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. And over it comes. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Perfect challenge. Steven Bergwijn. It's with Berghaus. Can he take the chance? A goal! And it's very much game on here! So Ajax just one behind now. And you really sense the momentum maybe with them. 
The verdict is offside here. Henderson. And he's made headway. Still possibilities. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Ajax in a position of menace. A fine reading of the situation. Sebastian Szymanski. Real chance. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. And defensive play to be applauded. Well, the first half is almost over, and a first half that Ajax largely would like to forget all about based on the performance and the scoreline, Stuart. Well, they can certainly play better than this. It's been a disappointing first half display from them, but if they can just play with more urgency and energy in the second half, they can get back into this. They definitely have the quality. Henderson. Given away by Ajax. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Well, spot on with that challenge. And a long way out. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. And we will have just one additional minute. That is that for the first time. And so off and running again. There was a real golf in class in the first 45. Will we see an improved effort from Ajax in the second? And passing it well. And collected tidily, he had plenty to think about. And unable to keep possession. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Moving it forward. And the keeper able to hold on to it. And a fine tackle. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Good technique displayed. Can he get one back? He can! He's given his team a real opportunity. And momentum is with them. Genghis Under. And well positioned to clear. That's a good pass. Tadic. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Playing it short. And narrowly off target here. Well, it's still all to play for, but that was a good effort, wasn't it? Given away by Ajax. And the keeper will take charge of that one. Oh, lovely ball. Tadic. Oh, he's gone for goal. And using his body to good effect. Opportunity it is. Determined defending. So Ajax behind, but what could they do with this corner? Oh, 
Well, nicely cut out. Steven Bergwijn. Benabachi doing well to regain possession. And space to exploit, maybe. And making the move to the inside. Now in a more than decent position. Tadic. And a useful cross. Making sure nothing came of it. But you can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking it to come, you would think. Dames and heren, the winner van de loterij is Von Massosa. Het winnende lot is van. And nicely over the top. And will it be the leveler? And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Not showing good defensive judgment. Bergwijn. Steven Berghuis. Just the challenge that was required. Dusan Tadic. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Ten minutes left for play. Oh, offside. How marginal was that? But the flag is raised. And he read it well, intercepting it. Oh, great vision. Well, that has been deemed offside, Stuart. Well, he took too long to get the pass away. It's as simple as that. And Fenerbahce with the ball again. Magnificent defending. Sebastian Szymanyski. Ferdi Kadioglu. It's with Bergwijn. And let's see what attacking position. It's not too late for them. Well, a decent idea, but just slightly overcooked. Bon Sosa. It's with Bergwijn. Henderson. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Nice looking pass. He'll have a go here. And there it is, the full time whistle here, and it's a victory. It was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. This is when it really hits home. Kickoff time is almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams that truly deserve to be on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they do it with the pressure on and when it matters most? Hello and thanks for joining us live here on EA TV.
Joining me, Guy Mowbray, for commentary will be Sue Smith. And hopefully we've got some goals and drama on the way. Your thoughts on this game then, Sue? Thanks, Guy. Well, I'm really looking forward to this one. Today. Real opportunity. Well, that hasn't taken long. In front already. Oh, the beautiful game very much on display. Berghaus. Some good work to win it there. And that's a foul and a free kick. It might still happen. And there's his second of the match, leading the way for the team. Third one. Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. Pushing forward now to make the right choice. And that's not a bad save at all. Henderson. A turnaround in possession. Excellent positioning. Not so much given away as cleverly won. Brian Brobby. Good work to regain possession. Brobby. Excellent reading of the game to win the ball. Oh, good ball in behind. Just needs the composure now. Very well kept out, alert and ready. Borna Sosa. Brian Brobby. Having a look. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Well, it was looking good, but ultimately nothing doing. Plenty of open space here. And they can keep the pressure on with a corner. Into the box it goes. And it's not the best of clearances. Steven Bergwijn. Robbie. Just waiting for the moment to break through. Picks out a teammate. Good work to recover possession. Brian Brobby. Moving forward well. And this could be. And the work pays off as they get the ball back. Borna Sosa. Steven Berghaus. Waited beautifully. An attack of genuine promise now. And stopped in their tracks with a change in possession. And we could watch that sort of skill all day. Has to be. 
It's there. And the gap is narrowed with time for more to come. On the spot, the attack further into life here. The effort shut out. It's a corner and possibly the chance to go further in front. Well, chances won't come too much better than that. Johnny Castro Otto. Untidy in possession there. Henderson. Bergwijn. Oh, a great chance. Must have switched off there as the ball is lost. Beautifully weighted ball. In the right position to cut out the pass. And that'll do it. And there's the restart. Off we go again. Really nicely played. What can they do with this now? Superb defending to clear his lines. Johnny Castro Otto. Thomas Kedjora. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. stopping him yet oh chance here well he's kept that out nicely well he's produced a masterful performance up to this point 10 out of 10 well he's been outstanding hasn't he he's taken his goal so well but it's everything about his play that's quality wouldn't surprise me if he gets his hat trick in the second half can he finish it's in and of course it's in it's a masterclass in finishing to complete his hat-trick. That's been viewed as a foul. A free kick's awarded. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. Suálio Meite. This is a good run. Now, can he pick out the right option? To reduce the deficit. And they've scored a goal to get the stadium jumping. Read the pass well and cuts it out. That's a pretty poor error, to be honest. Didn't have to do that. Ball taken away from them. Bergwijn. Really good pass. Great chance here. Great defending. Oh, that's been won really smartly. So, sir. Here's the shot. Excellent work in goal there. Well saved. Well, any chance has gone for now. Chutalo. 
Henderson. Berghaus. A move of real promise developing. Well, it looked promising, but only up to a point. Found nicely and in. And there's another one. Valuable breathing space for them now. Making good progress here. They've given it away here. And the ball has been nicely cut out. Brian Brobby. Robbie, and this could be it's a three goal lead and the win almost guaranteed a little sloppy on the ball there Berghaus They could get caught out on the break here. A good advantage played by the ref. Oh, it was a good advantage played, but now a free kick with nothing really developing. Well, it was looking good, but ultimately nothing doing. a lovely ball there might be something building now well what a place to lose the ball just when the chance was on lovely incisive ball The defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. Weighted beautifully. Oh, that's not properly away. Will it open up for him? There it is. Dispatched well, much to the delight of the fans. So that will do it for today, and it's the visiting fans. We weren't the better side on the day, didn't deserve to win, to be honest, but they won't care. The game plan worked well, they showed great character to get the result in the end. and unbeatable feeling of match day is in the air and the knowledge that this has all the most... A warm welcome to you and thanks for joining us for another game live on EA TV. Guy Mowbray here for commentary with Sue Smith alongside me and every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Fiorentina and they take on Ajax.
Thanks, Guy. Well, being in and around the ground before kickoff. Bergwijn, and there it is. 1 0 already. Robbie. Now a sense that something could happen from this. But it will now be tidied up and cleared away. That's gone out of play. Throw in to come. Rolando Mandragora. Perfectly anticipated. Really well won. Game brought to a halt, a free kick given for that. Goes for goal! And the defensive wall has done its job. Promising ball. Artur. Oh, that's how to win the ball. Robbie, fantastic looking ball and the attack is over really good defending showing good width with this attack this to level it it just needed the finishing touch a nice move ends there Gonzalez. Beautifully weighted ball. Well, they could have had a great chance. It's offside, but not by much at all. Gonzalez. What a chance! And it's there to equalise. Settle in for the rest of this. A great game already. The Lotti. Struggling to keep the ball there. He's drifting into a useful position here. And that's where it ends. Berghaus. And it's been given as offside. A turnaround in possession. Excellent positioning. Andrea Bellotti. Gonzalez. Genuine chance. And there's his second of the match, leading the way for the team. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. Plenty of space to attack now. Oh, they were getting interested there, but not anymore. Advantage played, no free kick. Well, with nothing coming from that, it will now be brought back for a free kick. Artur. Can he finish? And there's another one. Valuable breathing space for them now. The ref allowing play to continue. Burghouse. That's not a bad looking ball. Gonzalez. And possession given away.
Gonzalez. The defence does its work. Mandragora. No need to worry about that effort for the keeper. Jordan Henderson. Oh, nice vision in that pass. Possession lost just at the point of something happening. Bergwijn. Robby and it's on now well it was looking good but ultimately nothing doing well the first half is drawing to a close and the fans are understandably happy what an impressive performance they've seen Sue yeah they'll be the happier of the two sides guy at times they've been able to carve open the opposition and they've had some good finishes too they'll be looking to keep this going for the second half Oh, a great chance. And it's a decent stop by the goalkeeper. They opt to go short with the corner. Trying to carve out the angle. And that'll do it. The end of the first foot. And we're off for the second half. Could turn out to be a really good ball. Oh, chances don't come much better. They really should be taken. They should, and when you're through 1v1, you've got to find the back of the net. He could have just placed it. Bergwijn. There's a sense of real urgency to this attack. Berghaus. That's a free kick, and you couldn't choose many better spots for one. Oh, brilliant! Everything about that was just right. Nikola Milenkovic. Cristiano Biraghi. Showing good width with this attack. But that's where any chance of anything developing disappears. Gonzalez. Artur. And that's nicely won to see off the threat. Not a lot of time for him. A chance to deliver into the box. Artur. Mandragora. Oh, crucial tackle to deal with the danger. Henderson. Berghaus. And they complete the comeback from being two goals down. They're level now. Stephen Bergwijn. Kwame. Switched on and ready to intercept there. They're allowing space and he's finding it. A terrific tackle. The chance has gone. Now to deliver a good ball in. Good pressure this high up the pitch.
promising looking ball and a cross into the area well that's how to clear it the noise level has increased they expected to win here today this is another opportunity to get a late goal this is a good run now can he pick out the right option Giacomo Bonaventura. Great chance here. And he's won the ball to stop the goal. Bellotti. The crowd urging him to shoot. Jordan Henderson. Not so much given away as cleverly won. And it's opened up for him. Well, I'm sure he thought he'd scored there. Great goalkeeping. Well, the crowds are up for this. They haven't had too much to cheer about for a while. But this is a big chance. And the hard work pays off. They won the ball. Now it needs a good ball in. Has to be. It's there. And into the lead they go. And the game restarts with very little time left for any more drama. No free kick, not yet. Advantage played. Jordan Henderson. And they need to be better on the ball than that. Oh, it was a wonderful chance, but he went to whack it rather than place it. Steven Berghaus. Brian Brobby. Not long to go, but there could be something happening for them now. To square things up. And the goalkeeper has that and keeps it in his grasp. Kwame. Ball taken away from them. Berghaus. They might have got in there, well cut out. Ragi. Oh, a great chance. That is brilliant. Powered home. And, it... and the game comes to an end with the home fans in positive. I thought they deserved to win the game, didn't they? They played some really nice stuff. I thought they... Yeah, and the work rate was excellent. It's a great result, that. The magical feeling of match day and the desire to lose. It's always well worth taking the ferry across from the European side to the Asian side of the Bosphorus, as we have done. Welcome to the Kadikoi district in Istanbul, the home of Fenerbahce. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson.
and we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Fenerbahce up against Pauk. Well, he's placed it wide. Really close shave. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Dusan Tadic plays with Cengiz Under on the flanks. And up front is the vastly experienced Edin Dzeko. Real chance. And a goal to open the scoring. A very bright start to this one. Sebastian Szymanski. And he's in. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Dunder. Can he put them in front? Marvellous anticipation. He's given it away. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Dusan Tadic. Dzeko. And hit with ferocity. Not out of the woods yet. And the attack fizzling out. Well, a good tackle. Genghis Under. That's a nice looking ball. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. What can he do with it now? Thumps clear. Not showing good defensive judgment. Jacko. Take it away. He won the ball. Fred! And he's gone for power. So close to finding the net. Ozdoev. And he's given it away. Oh, fancy footwork. Could be... Well, I was on the cusp of saying he's at it again. Look as though he might score again. Well, he's certainly looking sharp today. That could easily have been his second there. And a chance for him to nudge in front. A goal here, giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Getting in there to intercept. Well, he's certainly not alone. Might lead to a chance. Into the advanced position. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Dzeko. And he read it well. He might be able to make it through. Decent enough idea. Shame about the execution. Well, I don't think that was good enough. And I also think it was the wrong option. Jacko. Return to Jacko. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Despodov. Now here's Johnny. Incisive pass. Fancies it. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. And take it away. What can they do from here? 
And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. Is it going to be 3-1? And slot it home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Oh, skipping away. Well, can they be creative from here? It's there for him. And giving it real leather, but off the crossbar here. Well, he struck it with power, but he's got to keep that down. Samata. And possession given away. And support available. Could be dangerous. Real chance. The crossbar got in the way. And he scored not once but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Tadic. Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Kirill Despodov. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Samata. Promising looking ball. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And there it is, the half-time whistle. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Good vision, can he get onto this? Tyson... I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. He'll take this on. Really acute angle, but he kept going and trying. Well, I'm surprised he went for goal, but it almost paid off for him there. It's a good effort. Well, as those stats tell us, their attacking play today has been exceptional. Defenders have come out at the right time, the midfielder completely dominated the game, and the front player's movement has been excellent. Yes, the chances just keep on coming. No stopping them, apparently. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, they need to get bodies back. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. Samata. We're well, using the space really well, but now can they push on? An alert piece of defending. And snuffing out the danger. Tadic. Thomas Moorg. And Fenerbahce have it back now. Dzeko. Now oh, they've given him too much space. But they took care of the situation defensively. Genghis Under. Oh, fancy footwork. But a good piece of tidying up. Jekko. That is how to keep it out of the net. Well, did well to make the challenge, but a corner coming up now. And a short corner here. Is he going to put it away? Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. 
Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Just unable to get his cross beyond the first defender. Not a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Prompt defensive action called for. Soon Chu. He must finish. Still alive. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Ozdoev. And a fine tackle. And into the last 20 minutes. Tyson. Very quick thinking there. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Opportunity here. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Genghis Under. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, a disappointing end to that break. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Well, they've lost the ball. Genghis Under. Oh, it's off the post! Well, he took care of it defensively. And that was a very fine read. Able to get a body in the way. Jekko and quick thinking defensively they've regained possession Successful intervention, winning the ball back. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Dangerous looking through ball. Oh dear, not a great effort, was it? Tadic. That's not a bad ball. Well, that's a sad end to the attack. Ozdoev. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Managed to get it out of there. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their support. That just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. Stage is set and the tent. Welcome along to an evening that was made for football. The pitch is in great order, too. Guy Mowbray here, and Sue Smith is here to commentate with me. 
And hopefully we've got some goals and drama on the way. It's Fenerbahce and they take on Fiorentina. Thanks, Guy. Well, I'm really looking forward to this one today. It'll be interesting to see how both teams line up. But what an atmosphere we have here. I absolutely can't wait. This is the home side's team today. Yeah, it looks like a 4-3-3 and they are really good out wide. The relationships with both wingers and fullbacks are great. And the latter constantly providing overlaps to create 2v1 situations. Both have got good delivery, so it's just about getting on the end of things. This is how the visitors start the game. Yeah, it looks like a 4-3-3, and I think in midfield they'll have one deeper and the other two a little bit further forward. But they also have that option to have the two deeper line midfielders if they do start to get overrun. It's no surprise who we've picked out to have a look at here. What should we expect today, Sue? Well, he's a unique talent, isn't he? The way he can beat defenders, he can dictate the tempo of the game. Suddenly, when he gets on the ball, fans get off the seats. Such an exciting, entertaining player. I can't wait to watch him today. Mandragora. Not so much given away as cleverly won. That took a touch on the way out, throw in to come. Kwame. Promising looking ball. He'll take this on. Going for the blast on goal there, but accuracy has been sacrificed for power. Really nicely played. What can they do with this now? And no scraps for the attackers to feed off. Hung on to the ball well. That wasn't an easy one to keep in play. Mandragora. The ref allowing play to continue. Hiragi. Still level, but this attack could see that changing. Oh, wow! No right to score from there. It had to be perfect. Chimansky. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. Could turn out to be a really good ball. Unable to find anyone with that. Working hard to win it back there. Now there might be a chance as they keep it moving. Unde. Jeko. Good ball in behind. Now this has to be. No better side for a player than an open goal in front of them. Easy. The pass was red and the ball has changed hands. Read the pass well and cuts it out. Out it goes for a throw. Allowed to go a long way with this. Oh, they were getting interested there, but not anymore. Fantastic looking ball. And that has been a judge to be offside. They need to be better on the ball than that. Good vision. Well, speculative effort. It's hit the bar. 
Well, that was looking good, but nothing to come from it. Good work to recover possession. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? He's beaten his marker here. The chance to cross here. A promising looking attack, but it's come to nothing. A turnaround in possession, excellent positioning. Mandragora. And there's the whistle as the ref gives a free kick. And on that whistle. Off we go. The second half underway. Now, there could be something on in a moment. And ready for it coming his way. Well, the crowds are up for this. They haven't had too much to cheer about for a while. But this is a big chance. Promising looking ball. Promising looking ball. What can they do from here? And he's having a go. Tremendous! That has been absolutely thundered home. And not getting close enough here. Well, a bit of a wild attempt and no trouble for the keeper. Goal kick. Well, he's just mistimed it, hasn't he? Didn't catch it how he would have wanted. And well, that's the result. Played through nicely. Has the space to whip it in here. Doesn't want to lose it now. Chance for the equaliser. Great defending. Christian Kwame. Cristiano Biragi. They've lost it there and the attack is over. from a long way out oh my goodness what a strike from so far out that's absolutely sensational Gonzalez it's on for the shot oh just off target you certainly can't fault them for effort they keep applying the pressure and if they can just nick one they're right back in this and he's got behind it Saved and held on to as well. This has been comfortable, hasn't it? That back line just don't seem to have an answer. There's a real quality when they go forward. The movement, the crisp passes. I wonder how many they'll get if they continue with this tempo. And unable to retain possession. There's a chance for them to go now. This to get back into it. Well, I'm sure he thought he'd scored there. Great goalkeeping. A short corner taken. Having a try. 
Oh, top quality goalkeeping to deny what looked a likely goal. Gonzalez. A nice cutback. Very well kept out, alert and ready. Cengiz Under. Bit sloppy in possession. Ikone. And it's on now. There it is. A lifeline in this game. And surely momentum is with them now. Incredible. Sayunshu. They've given it away here. Christian Kwame. It's gone astray, and it was far too easy. Gonzalez. Oh, that's blatant. The foul committed to stop the attack. Could be a chance. But well watched by the goalkeeper and not one for the highlights. Ball taken away from them. They're still pushing forward in search of the equaliser. Having a look. Brilliant attempt. It very nearly went in. Oh, that's a great volley. Catches it sweet. Doesn't miss by much. Could turn out to be a really good ball. Switched on and ready to intercept there. Really nicely played. What can they do with this now? And still danger here. It's cleared and they can breathe easier. Approaching the final whistle now and the... Oh, bad tackle. And the ref will surely take action. Giacomo Bonaventura. Icone. From a long way out. What a terrific effort. That would have been special. Well, he watches the ball all the way, connects with it perfectly, but just can't find the accuracy. It's a great effort, though. Need to find a way to that late leveller, and this could be it. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? And the game comes to an end with the home fans in positive mood. Real hard-fought game. Both teams showed moments of quality. They worked hard, but overall, they'll be happy with the results and the performance. There is nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium.
It's always well worth taking the ferry across from the European side to the Asian side of the Bosphorus, as we have done. Welcome to the Kadikoy district in Istanbul, the home of Fenerbahce. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Fenerbahce up against Ajax. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Cengiz Under plays with Dusan Tadic out wide, and the lead striker today is Edin Dzeko. Body in the way, and the starting 11 for Ajax. Well, plenty of attacking width in this 4 3 3, but they'll need to get their midfield players to join the centre forward as much as possible. If not, he'll become isolated. Well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And nicely over the top. And Ajax with the ball again. Fred. Now Dzeko. Given away by Ajax. Takes aim! And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Under. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Really good, strong tackle, and it'll be a throw-in. Bon Masosa. Bergwijn. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Fred. Not the pass he had in mind. Not messing around with that clearance. Berghaus. Now the pass not finding its target. Genghis Under determined defending and cuts inside oh that is a wonderful piece of challenging Dzeko really well played pass that's a good ball well now he's let that run out of play and it will be a throw in here Berghaus. And a throw coming up after a really fine piece of tackling. Bergwijn took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And a creative look about this. Could play it in. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Outdoing his opponent. Chance for the leveller. And a good take under duress there. A very effective challenge put in. Now well, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given.
out of play for what will be an Ajax throw. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. So almost at half time, and they are making good use of home advantage. Still a bit of work to do, though. Stuart, your thoughts on what you've seen? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half time. And they've given back possession easily. Berghaus. It's got to attack here for Ajax. A really meat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. Genghis Under. And Fenerbahce couldn't keep it. Steven Bergwijn. Bergwijn, real chance, brilliant save, surely now, and he's gone and scored to level it again. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. And playing it through, and he struck the post. And the managers will now deliver the... So back underway here into the second half. Trying to open up the defence. And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Really good build up, but no end product. Fred well doesn't have to do it on his own well nothing comes of it it looked promising well making considerable progress with the ball Genghis Under well Fenerbahce sloppy in possession oh nice ball over the top to chase Bergwijn can't miss, surely. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Well, just a bit too much on the pass. And this will be a goalkeeper's ball. Josip Shutalo. And Fenerbahce with the ball again. Well, this looks really productive. What can they do from this position? And let's give credit to the defending. Bon Sosa. Incisive pass. Vital intervention. Now the corner to Ajax as they look for more. Still not clear. Has a go. And he's kept it out. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, not away properly. Could be. That is a tackle and a half. And passing it through. Real chance. And it's gone in, just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Feeding it through. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Not a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Under. Checo, chance. Oh, tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top class save, I have to say. Palmed away by the keeper. <laughs> A 
And that's going to be an Ajax throw in. Berghaus. And the clearance there means a corner. Over it comes. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Oh, good work by the keeper. Dusan Tadic. Dzeko. This looks more than decent. Can they put it away? And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. And Fenerbahce come away with it. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Well, he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Berghaus Tremendous intuition to win it back Oh, he looks threatening Happy to shoot And there it is, a goal But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best well, it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Steven Bergwijn. Good weight on that pass. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Genghis Under. Can he get one back? David Berghaus. Another good tackle. Berghaus. Berghaus. And teammates to play it to. Our oh, winning back possession. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Lovely ball over the top. And the ruling is offside here. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down. In terms of possession and chances created, they were second best. But they kept plugging away and got a very good win in the end. A game of colossal importance and a stadium packed to the rafters. We can't ask for A warm welcome to Amsterdam's Johan Cruyff Arena. My name's Guy Mowbray and I'm joined by Sue Smith on the gantry. And we should have a cracking contest here. 
Sue, what can we expect from the game then? Thanks, Guy. Well, both managers will be reminding the players that it's important to get off to a quick start, really attack the opposition and put them on the back foot from the off. Hopefully we'll get a good game. This is how Ajax line up. Well, it's certainly a good formation for someone who wants to play on the counter. You've got that protection of five at the back, and when they go forward, they're going to be hoping that at least one of the midfielders join in. Width will definitely come from those wing-backs, though. Oh, really good effort. Plenty of power, plenty of venom, but just leaning back slightly. Brobby. There's room to do something here. Terrific point-blank save. Well, I thought that had to be a goal, but the keeper pulls off a tremendous save. It's cat-like reflexes. They keep on coming. Corner again. Johnny Castro Otto. Thomas Kedzura. A bit sloppy in possession. Johnny Castro Otto. Able to come away with the ball. And that has stopped any potential danger. And the ref has played advantage here. Pushing forward with options available now. Oh, they were getting interested there, but not anymore. On he goes. Terrific. And it's on now. Brian Brobby. Ball taken away from them. Could be a chance. And it's nicely stopped and held by the keeper. Josip Shotalo. Not a lot of time for him. Steven Berghaus. Genuine chance. And they must keep the ball a little bit better. And he's got behind it. The visitors have had a lot of the ball over the last 15 minutes and they're starting to create plenty of chances too. You sense it's inevitable that the goal will come. It's certainly no less than they deserve. And they've got it back now. Good work to regain possession. And the game stops with the award of a free kick. Well, it takes a brave player to have a go from that distance. It's ended up nowhere near. Yeah, that was way off target, Guy. I'm not sure why he's even attempted it. Wasted a decent opportunity. Steven Berghaus. Good work to recover possession. Lovely ball. This could lead to something. to go a long way with this has to be there it is 
that's the breakthrough and fully deserved you have to say in the right position to cut out the pass a move of real promise developing Pressing high, and they have the ball again. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Looks to lift it. And that hasn't troubled the keeper at all. Well, he had other options, didn't he? And I think he chose the wrong one. But you've got to praise the keeper's positioning. Decent chance. Oh, excellent work from the keeper to deny a promising-looking attack. And the corner is fired in. Oh, he went for it. It was a wonderful try. A lot of players wouldn't even think of attempting that. But he shows great skill and his effort. It's not far away. What a superb goal that would have been. Excellent hold-up play. Delivered into the box. Oh, wonderful stop from the keeper. Yeah, he didn't have long to react, but you have to praise his reflexes. And with that, the first half in... And the game restarts. That's not a bad looking ball. Just needs the composure now. And that is superb goalkeeping. That is such a crucial save. He shows really quick reactions. It's a really good stop. A corner to come then. And an opportunity to extend this lead. Well, not quite fully away here. Picks out a teammate. Well, it was looking good, but ultimately nothing doing. A chance to deliver into the box. Coming in field now. Magomed Dostoyev. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. In behind, can he finish? And it's gone behind for a corner. And it's a short corner. Crucial defending. Well, he's made his mark on the game, proving particularly hard to play against. He's causing problems. The visitors have controlled the play in the past 15 minutes. They're making good opportunities too, and you think if they score again, they should go on and win this game. Hang on, goal here maybe. In it goes. Level once again. What a game this is turning out to be. Got room to operate in here. And delivered into the middle. Well, any chance has gone for now. And the threat has gone with the keeper in control. Steven Bergwijn. And the work pays off as they get the ball back. Could be something happening for them now. Looking to put the cross in. Pass was red and the ball has changed hands. The effort shut out. It's a corner and possibly the chance to go in front. And somehow he's been denied. Superb work. And possession given away. Moving the ball forward, what can they do with this? And stopped in their tracks with a change in possession.
Sosa. Ball taken away from them. Maite. Oh, nice vision in that pass. And that's a frustrating call for them. Mightily close. Well, I thought he was in there. It looked like he timed his run well, but the flag's up. He'd be so disappointed because that's really unlucky. Some good work to win it there. And able to come away with the ball. Possession lost just at the point of something happening. He'll try his luck. And they've got it back now. Now, if they score from this, they'll surely win the game. No stopping him yet. Cuts it back. Well, it was looking good, but ultimately nothing doing. Nicely sets it up. Great chance here. And that's nice and easy for the goalkeeper. Robbie. Pushing forward with options available now. But not the end result they wanted from an encouraging position. Magomed Dostoyev finds himself with space now. Good work to win the ball and stop something happening. space and he's finding it and there it is oh but the flag goes up it's not going to count well it looked close didn't it he certainly thought so as well and he's making that clear to the assistant promising move this a goal now would surely be the winner but that's where any chance of anything developing disappears being pressed here And the defender left behind. That's it. The ref brings a close to the action. The stage is set and the tension is palpable. 90 minutes of what should be highly entertaining and absorbing football to come. And it would take a brave person indeed to predict the outcome. What an enticing prospect.
next on EA TV. The floodlights are shining down on the players here in Amsterdam at the Johan Cruyff Arena. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Ajax facing Fiorentina. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Good-looking sequence. Artur. Well, here's the starting lineup for Ajax. Well, the wide midfield players and the fullbacks need to have a good understanding here. If the midfield players tuck in, then the fullbacks need to get forward into the space they vacate, just to give them some attacking width. And a look at the lineup for Fiorentina. Well, key to their success today will be the front three. If they combine well, are clever around the box and rotate their positions, they'll cause all sorts of problems. And how about that for a save? And short it is. Artur. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, when he receives the ball, the crowd will start shouting shoot, and that's exactly what he does. He hits it from distance, he's got great technique. How many special goals have we seen him score? Let's hope we get one today. Now, high-quality defending. Bon Sosa. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Josip Schutalo. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Artur. And a simple clearance, a good one. What can Ajax do from this position? Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Mandragora. Foul there. Free kick awarded. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Making sure nothing came of it. And Ajax recovering possession. Christian Kuame. Intercepting it intelligently. Christian Kuame. No way through. Oh, he looks threatening. It might be. Keeper did his job to begin with. And in the end, no damage done. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And let's give credit to the defending. Feeding it through. And there it is! 1-0! The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Nicolas Gonzalez. Bonaventura with it. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, it might still work out for them. It comes to nothing in the end. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. Oh, it's mischievous. Well, full credit to him. He had the audacity to try it. Well, that's so close to being a lovely goal. It just doesn't come down in time. Cristiano Biraghi. 
He continues his run. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And inching towards the half-time interval, Ajax with the advantage. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Velocity. Genuine chance. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Steven Bergwijn. Ajax in a position of menace, but timely defending when it mattered. Velocity on to Bonaventura. Big chance to get them on terms. And he's done it. Parate again. A magnificent game unfolding. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Velocity. Can they take the lead here? And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes! Incredible stuff! So... Into the second half then. Can Ajax battle back after that first 45? Nicolas Gonzalez. Been a good challenge. Nice looking pass. Henderson. Ajax ball lost. Mandragora. Velotti. In it goes. But it will not stand. Offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. And intercepts again. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. Oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Look what's happening. He got a good palm on it. Pressure on Henderson. Berghaus. Really good build-up, but no end product. Belotti. Now here's Biragi. Good ball over the top. And coolly done in the end. Berghaus. Bonaventura. Ajax pushing forward with options available. Oh, could be! And danger still! Still a chance! But no, it's not going to be an opportunity because the flag is up. Rolando Mandragora. Now well, he's given it away. And playing it through. Oh, he could finish! And a goal! Real excitement here! The equaliser! And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Ranieri. Can they create something from here? Benotti. And swiftly ending that attack. Oh, nice ball. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Oh, 
Well, he could really get at the opposition. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. This looks promising. Could take the lead. And tonight, and there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Henderson. Can they get in behind them? And teammates to play it to. It did look on for them, but not to be. Just 15 minutes remaining. Attacking possibilities for Ajax, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And passing it well. Benotti. A wonderful intervention. Oh, beating his opponent with ease must score well they needed a bit of goalkeeping inspiration and that's what they've got well that just about keeps his team in this one but are they good enough to go and get the equalizer Artur my goodness that save fully stretched he was one for his own highlights reel it's a short one Bonaventura here and good use of advantage the referee allowing play to continue and just over the bar albeit narrowly effective piece of pressing five minutes remaining and one thing is certain no one is leaving because it's still close and Fiorentina have it back now and plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position can he finish them off? well somehow the goalkeeper got to it Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure victory. Cuts it back. And he read it well defensively. And we will have just one. Oh, could be. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Now the short corner routine. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as... They didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. A city imbued with the spirit of excitement and a stadium enveloped by... Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening, it's absolutely ideal.
I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It is Pauk and they take on Fenerbahce. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Cengiz Under plays with Dusan Tadic out wide, and the lead striker today is Edin Dzeko. Cuts it back. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Now, what can they do from here? Oh, did so well to deny him. Keen to take it short here. Despodov. Surely! And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, not enough subtlety about that free kick, I'm afraid. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. And he did well to cut it out. Well, out of play, under pressure. Nice looking pass. Miles from goal. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. And the short option preferred. And he takes it on. But the goalkeeper didn't have to work quite as hard as I thought he might initially. Moorg. Well, a good tackle. Fred. Can he find the net? And he'll take efforts like that all day long. Mete. There to take it away. He's got to have a go here. A oh, strong hand on the ball. Well, they might be piling on the pressure, but they've got to make it count in those situations, that's for sure. Can he find the right pass? They're putting so much effort into winning back possession. And Fenerbahce have it back now. Excellent vision. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. Oh, nice ball. Tyson Samata on the ball a foul but advantage played good looking cross sound piece of defending took a really smart piece of defending to stop them and having a go well, the shot seemed like a good option, but goalkeeper's ball. Ziku. Plenty of options. Under. An alert intervention. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. To make it 2-0. Goal! Taking aim from the spot and finding the target. Kirill Despodov. 
Now here's Johnny. And that a play for a Fenerbahce throw. Tyson. And he's made headway. Oh, stellar defensive work to get back and win possession. Is it going to end up being productive for them? A goal! And it's very much game on here! So there we have it, 2-1. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Oh, tremendous vision. Blocked it brilliantly. Well, it just petered out. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Samata. Can he do it? Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. And I think, unfortunately for him, the less said about that attempt, the better. Well, he had a lot of options there, but he's chosen the wrong one. That was a poor effort. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And he's given us away. And with that, the first half draws to a close. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Abdul Rahman Baba Moorg Must be! Oh, great block! Moorg Nice weight on the pass Big opportunity Well, there it is! Can you believe this? From two down, they now find themselves level. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Oh, he's gone for goal. The crossbar got in the way. Well, threat over for now. Well, they so nearly took the lead there. They just have to keep creating these opportunities, and I'm sure the goal will come. And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. Well, the short corner routine. Genghis Under. Determined defending. Now can they counter clinically? on the shot oh he saved it well and taken short can they stop it going in well nothing untoward happened Samata well that's a super ball over the top Effective press. Went in strongly, decisively. Moving it forward. Stopped a certain goal. Kadioglu. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. It is to be a throw-in. 
Read that pass all the way, cutting it out. And threading it through. Really good build-up, but no end product. Can he put them in front? Oh, the goal! Can you believe what we're watching? It truly is a comeback and a half. Safe pair of hands, did his job. And cutting it out. Opportunity it is. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Just 20 minutes remaining now. This attack looks highly promising. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Thomas Moorg. Tyson. Benabachi doing well to regain possession. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Tyson. Oh, great vision. And defensive play to be applauded. Oh, a struggle for Fenerbahce to hold on to the ball. Jekko. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, can they be creative from here? Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Well, that would certainly have wrapped up the victory. They're not quite home and dry just yet. Well, a game of such fine margins, but let's see if they can create another opportunity. Well, late in the game here, they know what they need, and that's an equaliser. And the pass deftly cut out. Tadic. Superbly read and executed. And coolly done in the end. Tyson. Now here's Johnny. The possession lost, intercepted. Manuski so Yunchu has it oh he's given the ball away one minute of stoppage time has been added on and teammates to play it to I'm comfortable in dealing with the cross and there goes the final whistle and it was very competitive chances at both ends but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory This is when it really hits home. Kickoff time almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams who demonstrably belong on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they?
Hello everyone and welcome to Florence, a city that attracts so many visitors on an annual basis. Of course, there are many who come here for the football. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's Fiorentina and they take on Fenerbahce. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And a look at the lineup for Fiorentina. Well, it's a 4-5-1, but with three of the midfield players giving close support to the centre forward, and the other two sitting deeper. Also, watch out for the fullbacks getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. What to like about that pass. And whipped into the box. Well, promised much, but delivered little in the final analysis. Well, you can see what he was trying to do, but in the end, he got it all wrong. Effective press. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Cengiz Under plays with Dusan Tadic out wide and the lead striker today is Edin Dzeko. Makes his way in field. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Bonaventura. Well, possession ceded by Fiorentina. Jaden Osterwalde. It's looking promising. Oh, he saved it well. Well, sometimes they come off for you. Sometimes they don't, Stuart. Well, he didn't get the technique right there, and as a result, he mistimes the contact on the ball. Well, when all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Bonaventura. There to take it away. Dzeko oh that's a super piece of defending Bonaventura oh, the pass not finding its target takes the shot and a goal to give them the lead they have their reward and taking it away he's taken on his opponents here and nicely parried away Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. Well, it was a splendid piece of goalkeeping, but he has to remain on his toes. Biragi. He's managed to lose his marker. Not all that convincing defensively. Exploiting the wide area. Cengiz Under. Oh, a vital piece of last ditch defending. Dzeko. Nicolas Gonzalez. Has eyes for goal. I'll tell you what, it wasn't a million miles away from the equaliser. Well, it was a decent chance, but they're still behind here. They needed to take that one. Tadic, good effort here, able to get a body in the way, 
Well, a corner kick it is. Let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage. So, deflection, and it will be a throw-in. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, the fans want to see a shot. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Outrageously skillful. Must take the lead here. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. And a throw here for Fiorentina. Nicolas Gonzalez. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. And clear behind for a corner. Playing it short. And a tidy ball. Prevented the damage. Counter-attacking chance. Under. Well, it was a good counter-attack in the making, but very alert defending. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. That's a nice-looking ball. Well, it would have delighted the fans had it gone in. Now the manager as well. So back underway here into the second half. Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Genghis Under. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. And I think, unfortunately for him, the less said about that attempt, the better. Well, he had a lot of options there, but he's chosen the wrong one. That was a poor effort. Oh, he's lost possession. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal. Because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second 45. Oh, he saved it well. Not quite what they were working on in training this week. And Penabache couldn't keep it. And the danger is averted. And he has options available. And a long way out. Well, not quite the result he was hoping for with that shot. Close, though. And passing it through. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Getting forward. Trying his luck from long range. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that. And it was close. Well, his skill level is so high. You're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Well, it clearly was deflected. So it will be their throw in. Well, as you can see, Fiorentina have controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. And choosing finesse, he might be wishing he hadn't. Well, it's good vision, but not the skill to match, I'm afraid. And that'll end up being the keeper's ball.
Nicely timed tackle. And quick thinking defensively. Promising attack this. Good through ball. And the keeper's hand does the trick. Nicolas Gonzalez. Good distribution. And delivered towards the back post. I think we're going to be viewing that goal time and time again. Bonaventura. And defending as a unit. Good weight on that pass. an effective clearance now we're inside the final 15 minutes Christian Kuame in behind for him to chase oh body in the way crucially elects to go short Viragi Christian Kuame and Fiorentina regaining possession what a powerful effort but just wide Genghis Under well a good tackle that's not a bad ball took a really smart piece of defending to stop them Do they have a goal in the future? They're giving it a go. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Distributing it well. Well, that looked to be quite dangerous, but just a fraction off. Artur. Rolando Mandragora. And Fenerbahce with the ball again. And space for them here on the flank. And a long way out. Delivering it into the box. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper. But it didn't. Oh, splendid skill. Could be a chance to break here. Well, they couldn't quite use that break in the manner that they'd hoped. Tadic. And now having a go. Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. This could level it. And all square now. And you have to ask the question, is the time for either side to win it? Nikola Milenkovic. Ranieri. And that is that. The night. 